I'm Omni Rusted. Welcome back to RimWorld. But before we go into that, I want to show you something. Because this was shared with me by uh, Xenomore. Um, and I feel like an idiot. In this tutorial, I'll be going over the basic mechanics of RimWorld fluid ideology. First now, of course, I can't go into the whole thing uh, and show you exactly, like, I can't show you the video. That would be very against TOS. Uh, but Rodamont here, Radamant, Ratman, 12 pound rat, uh, 24 pound rat, has uh, shown me that we need to, yet again, restart everything if we want to have fluid ideologies. So, we're keeping everything the same. Same mod list. Link down in the description. Um, we're going again with bandits. Uh, there's just one thing that we need to do, do differently. Uh, so let's see, where do we want to go? Xenomorph. That's the planet we're going to. I think we've been to this planet before, but I'm changing a couple things around, like the spelling and whatnot. So let's look at this planet. Find a boreal mountain to go live in. Planet Xeno? Yeah, that sounds safe. Doesn't it? I just realized I never took my pills this morning. I need to do that. It's been a weird morning. Oh, shit. Squish, can you hit that? That's a hoss. Uh, go ahead and ban that really quick hmm, I want to place get an alien flashback we all are are you able to ban that right now squish or is somebody else gonna take care of it I want it to be very centrally located or at least close enough that I can travel to other places you're not able to do it right now? We can call in other people later if, uh, if you get too busy. Like, there's a lot of these around here that I'd be able to trade with and or, you know, raid. You don't know how to? You slash ban type the name uh but i want an empire close by there is one like way up here so i might be able to like build like somewhere around here in this place with sandstone and granite which is remarkable but let's check out uh these areas first because these two were hostile anyway well i mean they're gonna be hostile everything's hostile i'm bandits uh but i want to see if i can get a river Marble granite, no caves. That's the one. Close to a path, close to all these places to trade to. Empire up here. You didn't see their name? Yeah, no problem. Don't worry about it. Just that's the asshole which Twitch refuses to take care of. They sent him a cease and desist in the mail. He doesn't live in the country, Twitch. Now, the thing that I was doing wrong in creating ideologies that are fluid is there's a fluid ideology button. I kept hitting customize. That's it. Never looked on the left hand side, kept looking over here at custom. I I feel so dumb. So we're gonna try and go back to the Magitech Empire, which was I think it was ideal. No, it wasn't ideological. I think it was abstract theist. Yeah, because we worshipped elementals, and we believed in the machine, machine god. Choose one meme to form the initial idea of this ideology. We get to start with one. So, what do we want to start with? I think we should start with raider. We're bandits, right? Or we could start with transcendent, which is magical. Or transhumanist, which is technological. 
Or hell, go, go... Well, these are impact medium. We can also go with the low impact and go, like, supremacist. Hmm. I don't have any dice. I don't have any dice on me. Let's let's find a die here. Uh, random dice roller. Guilty corruptions. Uh, guilty is our people carry guilt from ages past. Others are more worthy. We idealize idealize pain. Um, we have to go charity, uh, important or worthwhile causes. We get symbol burning and we get the torture crown. We, it's basically pain worship. You need 10 ideology points to alter your ideology later on the line. You get points through rituals. I, I don't know if Magitek Empire, if we go off the Final Fantasy VI kind of, kind of belief system, would really go with guilty unless we're trying to make up for this. Because, like... If we're going to go with, we worship the god Kefka <laughs> again, but like, do you think we should just like keep this fluid and just go as it works? Like, like, uh, let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five. I think we should start with Raider because we're starting bandits. That's my, that's my idea. I think I'm going to go with Raider. That's, that's. Post the Final Fantasy Fallen World like the Empire after Kafka took over. Kinda, yeah. Oh. I see what you mean. Yeah, I'm gonna start Raider though. No, I'm gonna start Guilty in that case. We'll school go Raider first. That's actually a good point. We are we are post Empire. I like that. I like that. Uh let's see. Uh Sacred Temple, um, Magitech Empire. Uh, we were... G Knights. Adjective... Uh, no, damn it. No. Reset. Reset. I can't reset. I, I don't know what the hell that means. Uh, randomize. That's... Definist. Um, yeah, that would just be Magitech. What's the tower in that game with enemies only weak to magic? You have to always reflect on. Oh, shit. I don't know. I, I know what you're talking about, though. I always took the Moogle in there because the Moogle's dance just walked through everything. Ritual room is the temple. We are Magitech Empire. We are the former Magitech Empire. Uh, what symbol were we using last time? Oh, that one kind of makes sense, actually. Cultist Tower, that was it, yeah. But those dudes, like, straight up worshipped Kafka. You can only add up to four total memes later down the line for the ideology, so you have a max of four or five. Really? That's a little disappointing. We'll stick with that one and a nice bright blue, nice dark blue. Um, current points. Uh, we are going to be, I believe, techist because there's not really anything for for magic. We had in Zeno's gun relic. Yeah, <laughs> I like that. Uh, so charity is essential. Pain is idealized. Is there a thing for magic in here? Execution, horrible if innocent. Yeah, that makes sense. Slavery has to be acceptable. Otherwise, we can't have our necromancer. Uh, physical love is free. Because it's it makes no sense to have it otherwise, to me, in my world. Uh, sculpt spike disapproved. Eating nutrient paste is disgusting. Scarification horrible. Why would that be horrible? That would. No, I can't. I I mean, like, if we're if we're guilty, wouldn't scarification be revered? I don't know. 
Yeah, I can't set it to revered. Just minor heavy and extreme. That's weird. Gonna need as many rituals as we can. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. But look, it's already trying to give us a holy gun. Okay, so, um, what did we name everything last time? The leader was... It was like, it was something that was like in the, the game normally. I don't know, Divine Chief doesn't sound right. Um... Oh god, what word am I trying to think of? There's a word that I'm going for right now and it's just escaping me. Fuck it. Uh, whole, uh, preceptor. And remove the coats because, remove all that because it messes with everything else. Uh, and this will be Arcanist. Uh, we can't get any more guides. We can't get any more roles right now because it's going to be fluid ideology. Rituals, uh, that's a dumb name. Sepulcher. Sepulcher. Divine Funeral, Requiem, Ignoble Burial, Shameful Eulogy, Maginite Morning. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just uh, any time. And we will do. Recharge Mana. No, we'll do Rain Dance. We'll do Rain Dance. What else can we do here? Um, Relic Ragnarok. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, did you take the sword over the... the... the Magisite? Uh, I want a Sky Lantern Festival. Because I just love Sky Lantern Festivals. It's also named Godly Celebration, apparently. Uh, this one will have... Spaceship Chunk Call. Why not? Magicite is Technological Compressed Esper. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Um, I can't really get much here. I might have to add more things later on. Blue Symbol Burning. Sacred Festival. Uh, oh, we could just set it to Random Reward. Yeah, that works. Uh, I took Unworthy Chancel? Maginite Altar. Pews are fine. Now, let's add some relics here. So, I want... Uh, first off, the Holy Minigun. It has to be a thing now. Mini get of the Holy Crusade, okay. And then I wanted something to represent Magisite. Um, there is... There's that new element from Rimworld of Magic, but I don't remember what it's called. Magicite looks like a castle. I know what it looks like. I want to get it as a tattoo one of these days. You know, if I ever get tattoos. I just, I swear there was something. That would have been perfect here. Terra Esper mode tattoo. It's a pretty good one. Nope, I'm just I'm just drawing a blank.
We could just put it on a wand. <laughs> we'll go with an amulet. Maybe a nah, an amulet, yeah. Uh Majesite of Ragnarok. Made from Sky Steel. It's gotta be. Um, do we want another one? Final Fantasy VI, uh, Advent of Life needs one of these buildings, FG Pyre, Sacrificial Flag. Yes, it does. One more. We gotta have, like, one more. I mean, I don't know if I, I can add relics as a part of my fluid ideology. I will not have red goo as a venerated animal, excuse me. Need a melee relic? Can we have Ultros as an animal? I don't think... I mean, there's... There's sand squids. <laughs> That's about the closest we come. Um, one more relic. I'm trying to think of something. The chainsaw would really be it. Yeah. What? Okay. Yes, I know exactly what it needs to be. The best weapon in the game. Okay. Uh, venerated animals. So I found out acanthamoebia, acanthan, acanthamoebia are not what I thought they were. Those are cleaners. Dark hound for an animal. It that doesn't fit with the. I mean. I mean, I guess we are kind of going straight for like a, a thing. So we could go with the Dark Beast. But why? Why is it our venerated animal? That's the question. Then again, there's like nothing here other than like the anima yaks that I could really see venerating. So if we could find an Ultros clone. We are guilt, they could be our former guardian beasts. You never played Final Fantasy VI, did you, Zeno? <laughs> but uh, we are we are going very strongly towards that. I think we're gonna go with Anima Warg. That's a good like halfway point right there. Kind of magical, kind of wolf. I think I like that one. Okay, so we're going with the fluid ideology of the former Magitech Empire. Uh, and of course, we've got to edit uh, deity name Kefka. Deity title God of Magic. I'm not going to go with the Umaro. Be dumb. Kafka gave birth to humans in a grand accident. That tracks. Looked upon them with curiosity. Across the vast stellar distances, Kafka's will sustained the life of mankind against the void. The believers went forth and conquered, burned, and raped for a thousand years, and Kafka's grief at their depravity consumed him. That's heavy! <laughs> That, that's, that's heavy. Uh, oh, it changed all of that. Oops. Uh, just remove, remove, edit, Kafka. Not Kafka. <laughs> that's, a, that's a completely different thing. Uh, deity named Kafka, god of sin. I like it. We are messed up people. Yeah. Uh, did that change anything else? Kefka's Preacher. I like that, actually. Divine Bishop, that's okay. Kefka's... It, it, it changed everything. Wow. Kefka's 
Kafka's Preacher, Fiesta, F Fiesta of Kafka, sure. Penitent Celebration, Jubilee of Sin. It, got, it gave me two different Skylander festivals. <laughs> we need a symbol burning. No, I said symbol burning. Oh, symbol burning's right there. It, I see what it did. Okay. My bad. Uh, Celebration of Sin, Fiesta. Yeah, that, that, that works. That works. Fuck it. Kafka's final words in the game reminded me of that. I don't remember his final words, actually. Anytime, random ward. I wanted this to be the big altar, but I think that's it. It renamed all of these! Why? Why did it rename everything? Uh, what was it? What was it? Minigun of the Holy Cruc Crusade. Are we going to try and turn from our dark ways or embrace them? I haven't decided yet. God damn, it changed everything. No, no beards. Never beards. Because that's broken. Okay. Did it change anything else? Now it's allowing scarification. Oh, okay. In that case, we have to add a scarification ritual. Ugh, sacred peeling. Mangling of shame, a shameful mangling, unworthy mangling, ignoble cutting. Ignoble cutting works. Free love changed again? No, it's just this physical love free. I wish you could make it so like you don't have to be spouse. <laughs> Maybe we go with spouse only mild? We can change it later. Alright, we're gonna try that. Taking like 20 minutes to do this. There we go. Form of Magitek Empire. Not what you meant. Okay, well, what... What changed? Nothing, nothing else changed. Now I'm, now I'm paranoid. Versus ugly, blindness horrible, or can use no harvent, cannibalism abhorrent. Yeah, nothing else changed. This is gonna bother me, the charity essential. Because every time beggars or refugees come along, I have to take them. Wanderer rejected negative eight. Holy crap. God help all the mimics, yeah. The women and men are spouse only for partners. Um, I'm not seeing what you're seeing here, Zeno. Physical love, spouse only, mild. Women, spouses, one only, men, spouses, one only. Marriage name, random. So I'm not seeing what you're seeing here. Hey, Andrew Dan. I don't know how the changing later works. Women and men, only one. I thought we were free partners. No, it's not. We're not going with the polygamous society, no. We're a guilty society. We don't get to enjoy ourselves. <laughs> okay, so we get four people. I need a... I mean, same as always. Leader, uh, constructor, miner, farmer. And whatever. 
I'll need to be combat capable. No, we're going with guilty. Why do people get to be happy? <laughs> um, that's a pretty good leader. They're a shooter, not a melee. I don't know if that works for you, Squish. I'll leave that up to you if you'd be okay with shooting. Um, I don't remember what magic you go with usually. Uh, secondly, Dill Quick Sleeper, beautiful shooting. That's a really good farmer. That's a really good farmer. And I had somebody. Yes, I had one new person ask for a colonist today. Kara. We suffer seeing their partner in another person's bed. That's what I thought. I'm... No, because... Trust me, as a polyamorous person? That's a no. Actually, Zeno, you don't have a role if you want to take farmer. We can change that one around, although it's shooting. Oh, wait, you wanted to be shooting. <laughs> Ooh, iron wheeled Sanguine Cannibal. But that, that one's amazing, actually. That's... Hey, guess what? That's an Andrew Dan right there. That's an Andrew Dan. And now we need a Constructor Miner. Uh, preferably one that can do combat. So, Squish, how do you feel about being a shooter and not melee? My favorite character in FF6 is Edgar, by the way. Same. He's the best. Mm. Optimistic Aesthetic is really good. He'll keep happy while doing the underground stuff. His name is Ziggy! <laughs> That's like perfect! Okay. Like I said last time, I'm good with any rule as long as I'm ranged necro. Okay, yeah, ranged necro we can absolutely do. Okay, so uh, let's see. I don't know if... Uh, you know what? We can just change that. I want to change that anyway. Um, and Squish, what were we gonna give you as a as a class? I, I don't remember. I could be Edgar, Technomancer Social. I mean, yeah, Technomancer wouldn't really get you anything unless we went for the turrets. I'm trying to think of oh yeah, you were barred last time. Um, I'm trying to think of anything else. I might use technom technomancy of some kind. Because there's like snipers and commander and stuff like that. Enchanter. Um yeah, I think you might be right. Other than like Yeah, I think it's it's gotta be Technomancer. Let's go to look at the Technomancer stats. Uh, let's see. Social impact, negative 30%. Trade price improvement, negative 20%. They are horrific at social. Wow. That, that's bad. You'd have to research. You wouldn't be able to do uh, any, any social. So you'd make a terrible leader. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Magic Crafter? I mean, yeah, but like if he wants to be leader of the colony, it would have to be A, a crafting uh, role, which he's not. <laughs> B, if he wants to be leader, he has to be social. I know I'm not being leader. We could absolutely have multiple researchers. I do not mind that. But this is not a crafter class. However, Technomancers can absolutely be a really, really good uh, researcher. They get plus twenty-five percent research speed. It means somebody else would have to be have to take the leader role, and I need to check on my social stats. So, if you're cool with that, I don't mind having a starting researcher is really good. Um, I am going to change this to Xenomorph. 
And later on, somebody else will take over as farmer. But this is, like, really, really good. So, let's see. Let's... Necro. And I think I want to get rid of Psychically Dull and Beautiful. And I'm going to give that to Trigger Happy. Because that is a great way to do that. Hey, Sushi! What's up? Uh, no beard. Hair is going to be... It was like a bright red spikes. That's it. Great big liberty spikes. <laughs> so tech researcher and give me blonde ponytail. Yeah, sure. Necro cook and animal handler. Yeah, yeah. That's basically how it's going. Uh, beard, no beard. I don't know why this is giving you a mustache. Why is it giving you a mustache? Uh, why is there a mustache? I don't, I don't understand. I can't change that. Okay, it does change. It's the hairstyle. It's the hairstyle. Okay, okay. Uh, let's look for a ponytail. And let's give it that dark, dirty blonde. Yeah, that works. Andrew Dan. Cannibal. Let's take away the cannibal. Go with Paladin. Which will be amazing to start with. Since my undead animal are basically buffed animals, it'll work for me. That's true. That's true. But yeah, starting with the Doctor Crafter. That's super good. And Sanguine Iron Willed. Andrew Dan will never have any problems. And then Tiggy. Can I have purple hair? Uh, yeah. You can't really, like, see it, but yeah. It's there. It'll change later on anyway, you know? They, they constantly change their looks now. Uh, and Tiggy. Aesthetic Optimist. I want it to be... Arcane. <clears throat> or we could go Geo since Tiggy did say Geomancers are totally cool uh, they get mining speed plus 25% mining yield plus 25% carrying capacity plus 20% global work speed negative 20 so not as fast at building I uh, will go with Geomancer though I just gotta actually concentrate on getting into the mountain for a change Let's check everybody's health. We get rid of all health things to begin. Except for the scarification, because that's a proper thing. But like addictions, those go away. Okay, I think that's it. Let's go. We actually have fluid ideologies for a change. Thanks to Radamont here. Radamont. Ratman. I hate this map. I abhor this map. It's terrible. It's terrible in every way. I love this one. <laughs> I love it less now that I'm looking at it. It's okay. It's all right. God damn, there's a car frame right there. That's really obnoxious. Uh, this is going to be difficult. All right, let's start off. Let's just do the same thing we did last time by having a whole bunch. Let's just do like a barracks. That everybody can just hang out in. Easier to heat and cool as well. Um, we do have technology, and I have to keep that in mind. I always forget. In fact, that means we don't have to worry about having to cook. I always forget that. I always forget. 
Okay, that's not gonna work for me in that case. Who's Lutz? I don't know. Uh... I didn't... I never renamed you. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sorry about that. <clears throat> Let's see. You know what? Screw this. We'll do it that way. Right there, and floors here for our nutrient paste dispenser. Although I'm gonna want to avoid that, to be honest. Did I get changed to Necro? Yeah, yeah. You start with consumes corpse and fog of torment. <coughs> uh, Squish started with sabotage kinetic shield. We need to pick either techno bits, Mark IV turret, or engineer weapon. Up to Squish there. I'm leaving that one up to Squish. Uh, Andrew Dan started with heal. Great one to start with. And Tiggy started with sentinel and in case. You know, just in case. Put a door there. We'll have our farm here. I'm not, I'm not gonna go big on the farm. It's it's gonna be a very, very short planting season. I don't even remember what our planting season is. Uh, let's see. Growing period, 20 to 60 days, 11th of September to the 1st of April, May. Average temperature, negative 1 to negative 23. Shit. Now it's negative 23 to 21. It's gonna be pretty bad. Push techno bit for crafting and such. You're basically just copying, uh, the cams then, huh? Uh, just huge amount of cotton. <laughs> Huge amount of cotton. We're gonna need it. Uh, heal roots. And then, no, don't click on that. Right there. And one more here. And then we'll do this filled with hay grass. I am not going to depend on my normal 25 by 25. Psychoid and smoke leaf. Okay. They, there's a lot of planting. We're going to start with the potatoes, though. More recreation in the morning or in the evenings. And do, 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 do. We actually have a doctor. I didn't mean to shout. I'm just very excited. Mm, yeah, Andrew Dan's going to be taking care of our crafting. Squishy will be taking care of our wardening just because he's got the skill for it. He's not great at it, but we'll see how that goes. Zeno will be taking care of our cooking, butchering, brewing, handling, hunting. Uh, Tiggy will, of course. The, 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 the. Uh, take care of our uh, building. Tiggy will not help with that because Tiggy will be busy. Turn that off. Two, four, two one and before i forget because i always forget no tainted no goddamn corpses because if i don't put that they will 100 percent go eat the first corpse they see and will not pay attention to what i tell them to no medicine to start with because we'll have very low amounts and I want to just make sure that they focus on it. And am I forgetting anything? I don't think so. Uh, Zeno, go ahead, grab that double barrel shotgun. 
Uh, squish is melee, so grab the dynamite. Andrew Dan can be either. Grab the double action revolver. Tiggy, you are Schustein. Where's the other revolver? There it is. Yes, I'm getting stockpiles. And bathrooms and all that stuff that you need to do first before anything else. Okay, no food, no plants. God, I've done this so many times. Alloys are fine, no corpses. This one holds plants. They're clear. Uh, plants, corpses, no human. Plant matter. All foods, no rotten. I think that's it. I think that's it. There's the anima tree. And let's start by going after predators. Which might be very dangerous, but we'll see. Um, actually, no. Oh, you don't have raised dead yet. Never mind. Never mind. Bathrooms. We need bathrooms. There's so many different things to take care of. The first part of the game. Wow, there's no water right there. That's that's wicked. You know what? Let's let's do like this. We'll dump our waste in here. So let's do like. And we'll get a window for lights. Get me, we don't have any wood. I forgot to set chopping wood. Can I tame us some muffalo? Yeah, it's a it's a good idea. Muffalo wool is some of the best. There we go. Thank you, Zeno, for getting us some wood. Great work. Wooden latrine. Get this up first, please. They can use the swamp water here to wash their hands. I'm not I'm not gonna make them use swamp water. <laughs> we will uh tap it for a well right now though. <laughs> Ignoble cutting expected. Whoa. Four Magenites want to carry out the scarification as soon as possible. To begin the ritual, select a focus object and click to begin the ignoble cutting command. Following our valid objects, ritual spot low altar. Following roles have a part. We do need to set some roles, but we don't have any social people. So, depending on the ritual quality, person negative two and plus two over six days. Yeah, we'll ignore that for now. Holy crap, we got the bets done fast. Whoa! Well, that's gonna make people happy. Tiggy put a roof over her bed and then immediately didn't sleep in it. I mean, the, the heads are still covered in rain anyway. And nobody likes it. Everybody's soaking wet right now. <laughs> uh, we need to get a horseshoe pin. I will just throw that right there. And then we'll get a torch lamp to start with right there. Now I'm not going to prioritize anything. I'm literally just letting them do what they want. I've set the priorities. I can trust their priorities now. I know I just said that I can trust Rimworld Pawns. That's a mistake. Chunks. There we go. Okay, that's done. Check occupancy, if you would, please. Boop, boop. And now we just kind of wait for them to catch up. Nope, that needs to be moved one over. Here we go. Everybody's leveled up their magic. Never trust the pawns. Never trust the pawns. It's a bad idea. Uh, going techno bit on Squish. I need to make sure. Offense protocol, repair protocol. And yeah, neural interface is where we start. Xeno. 
Uh, you need two points to learn Raise Undead, so we're waiting. Andrew Dan, uh, two points to Raise Hope. Tiggy, I do... What do I want to get? Earth Sprites? Stone Skin? Don't both take two anyway. Oops, did I set that wrong? I did. Hunt those, Xeno. Shoot them! Yes. And that also reminds me, we need a butchering table. <laughs> With my very, very low amount of steel. Of course Tiggy messes it up. Why wouldn't he? Oh my god, Tiggy. You're killing me here. You're killing that rat, too. That rat has gone mad. Butcher, do forever. There we go. A little bit of food. Where's this rat? Is it coming? Nope. Alright, Zeno's still hunting. Um, isn't Zeno our cook? Shit. Uh, Andrew Dan, hey, take over. Get us some food. Uh, squish, drink some chemshine. Don't want people had unhappy right now. Waiting for Zeno to get back. Although Zeno's probably over here shooting a world with trigger happy and not hitting anything. Yup, I was right. Whoa, that's a long walk to get back and forth. Whoa. Okay, that's a huge walk. We gotta... I don't know what to do about that. Build a bridge? Do I build a bridge that I can destroy or do I cut right through the mountain? Like, I want to use this for defense later. Uh, Xeno's about to go berserk. Get some chemshine. That's what it's for. Nom 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 nom. Okay, maybe let's not hunt anything on that side of the world. You can live for now, Mr. Wolf. I think I'll build a bridge going all the way over there. Be easier, to be honest. We could just go like... No, we can't. Wow. Eh? Hey, there we go. Right there. And I can have it go like... Here. That's a lot of work. <laughs> That's a lot of work. Let's go a bit less crazy with this. There we go. And of course, this will be done after everything in here is done, so. Which I'm going to keep expanding on for a table. Chairs. Uh, we have got to think of cooling this, so maybe I should start normal wood power. I hate starting with normal wood power this early. Let's take Squish off plant cutting. Start researching batteries. Squish has a look change desired already. Does not appreciate the ponytail, apparently. <clears throat> Miscellaneous? I can never find it. There it is. Styling station. It need why does that need metal for the for the um Yeah. Uh, the, the mirror. That makes sense. Okay, we need more hunting done. Uh, this arctic wolf apparently is dying, so we'll go after it. And then these ibex doe. And then the turkey. Let's keep this going, because people will be very, very upset. I'm not going to mount through the mountain, because I could use that as a defensive measure later on. I want to slow people down as much as I possibly can. Yeah, this wolf's just dying. I might not even have to hunt him down. He's just bleeding to death from that 
That one gunshot wound. You get hit once, but that's all it takes. Uh, Tiggy, why are we technically sleeping outdoors? You've done the rest of the walls, but not this one spot? Come on, buddy. There's the second level up. Which means we get Ray's Undead. Ray of Hope. Oops, I'm gonna click that. There we go, start casting that automatically to level up. And... Earthen Hammer. I'm gonna learn Earthen Hammer. And then start leveling up Sentinel, I think. Because Sentinels are a pretty good early game um, protection. Trying to get these rocks out of my way. Maybe I shouldn't have distracted Zeno from hunting. He's not bleeding to death anymore. He's actually going to get up eventually if he doesn't get killed. His wound's closed. He must die. I don't know if anybody told the wolf that. There we go. We're closed off. Yeah, we have to finish him off. I mean, that's where that's where you're going. Nope, you're going after a turkey, apparently. He's going to get up. Yeah, he's going to get up eventually. I don't care, though. Bring back food. That's all that matters. Because you are a farmer, and you're not doing any farming because you're also our only hunter. It's bad. There. A little bit of meat. Raw turkey. That sounds... Salmonella delicious. I fed two people. Uh, let's uh, let let's not do it through this menu anymore. That sounds like a bad idea. Instead, let's just go around with the hunt command and get like these small animals near us on our side of the mountain. We'll go to the ground runners. That's fine. Can I raise the wolf for a bodyguard? No, because they eat. The, the raising animals does not work. Uh, so I don't want to do it unless we have a lot of food. I don't know what Andrew Dan just had to happen. I think he gained a level. Pretty sure. So once we get a, a reliable source of food, hell yeah. It's an automatic tame. No problems with that. Right now, we don't have any food. A group of trans people in the Toxo Union. That looks like a group. His name is Bat. Body modder, nudist, kind, crafter. I love him. He's great. Is he attacking right away? Oh, well, he is. All right, everybody. I, I like this guy. I would really like to capture him if possible. I don't think it's going to happen, though. But if he doesn't, hey, we can always have a new friend anyway. So let's not get the Sentinel in this fight. And go beat him up with our feasts. And our sticks of dynamite, apparently. <laughs> nope, he dead. Alright, bye. Zeno, you stay here. Beep. Whoop. <laughs> Welcome, Bat. <laughs> we need to make you all the, all the things now. New outfit. Undead. And I'm going to make it so that he can use any clothing that is, uh, any clothing that is less than 50%, and he can use Tainted. We're going to do that this time. Because them walking around naked while it looks cool means that they're useless in combat. Uh, you are going to be, you look like a crafting thrall to me, so we're going to call you Brick Thrall. Although, that's not what you're doing at first, after all. Da 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 ba bump ba bump ba bump ba bump ba bump ba bump da 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 
There you go. You clean. Then you you do hall plus. You clean. Then you do stone cutting. And that gave Xenomorph a uh, better idea of how undead work. You got Bricky back? Yeah, you got Bricky back. It's true. Andrew Dan is just ray of hope and healing everywhere. More neural interface. Everybody wants an ignoble cutting right now. God, our food is not lasting. Since it looks like you'll be here for a while, Xenomorph thinks you should give the faction and settlement a name. Hmm. What did we name it last time? I don't even remember. I don't think that was actually a sentence I just said out loud. The Guilty Sinners. No, that's a that's that's too on the nose. Uh, that's just way too on the nose there. I remember the the name of it was Tomb of the Holy Minigun. Um, but what do we give the faction name? And something to do with the fact that we're kind of trying to make a Magitek Empire. We gotta get you a copy of Final Fantasy VI, you know. <laughs> There's like so many references here that you are just not getting. Which is not your fault, I mean. It's, it's a game from like, god, when I was a kid. I'm old. <sighs> That's our faction name. It's Kefka's Redemption. It's a terrible, terrible name, but I think it works. All right, Tiggy's building this up, which is good. That's going to help us speed up a lot. I do not like the fact that, that his work speed is negative 20%, so we're probably going to want to replace him later on uh, with somebody who can do better building, but that is just fine by me. And we need a way to get steel. I'm um, looking around, I'm not seeing any ruins at all. There's these ruins, which are limestone. And that's it. Okay, batteries are done. We need to go towards solar panels next. But we need to start digging into a mountain to get steel. And there's only tin and copper here. Uh, where's all this steel? What the deuce? There's like, there's just tin and copper. There's some steel way the hell down there. Whatever. We'll, just, we'll we'll try for this, see what we can make out of it. I don't think we can make any power, power things out of it, though. We'll see. Is there an ancient danger? If there is, I don't see it. It's probably in the mountain itself. 
Uh, Andrew Dan, um, wake up and butcher, please. We need, we need the meat. Okay. That works. Um, maybe I should have the Thrall do it. Yeah, we'll have the Thrall do it. Thrall can take that over. I need to start, I need to start splitting out the duties that everybody has. Um, actually, we could have the Thrall do the, grow, the the planting really quick. We have the Thrall to handle the planting while everybody's asleep. Where are you going? I'm also going to take apart that so the Thrall doesn't go to clean there. But the, the Thrall can handle the planting while everybody's asleep. And then we just go to harvest. Uh, the Saber crew is now attacking. Apparently we need more labor. Kieran. Tortured artist, misandrous, nimble. You are terrible. However, you're an amazing constructor. <sighs> That's a tough one. If I capture you, I capture you. Oh no, we're guilty and their name is Ancient Justice. Oh no. They know. Uh, Zeno, you're getting a little close to. Yeah, it's just let's let's get you back. I don't I don't like you being over there right now. Okay, now they're attacking. Uh, both of you, just go and try and beat him up with your feasts. He's got a knife. <laughs> he brought a knife to a gunfight. It's working for him. We'll be fine. Just a lot of blood everywhere, you know. Oh, hey, I don't know what noise I just made there. <laughs> I don't know what the hell that was. Uh, but we got that, so I'm going to change this really quick to prisoners because it's the only other room we have. Uh, Tiggy, capture. Um, he's got mana potion addiction. We destroyed his right lung. But we captured him, and I'm okay with that. Uh, Zeno, you're you're bleeding. Uh, let's get some beds on the ground until we're able to make a prison for him. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's make it. What am I doing? This is, this is a terrible idea. It's not going to work at all. Let's just do this. But I'm bum. Done. <laughs> and we'll just we'll just reinstall that in there. Done. I don't know why I'm overcomplicating it. Andrew Dan, get to work. What about the north wall for a prison? Plenty of room, only two walls. Uh, we'd have to go all the way around and through the marsh to really get in there. And he got infection. Boo. Wait, why was Squish taking care? Mm, I told Andrew Dan to do it. Oh. Actually, that is a much better idea. I see what you mean now. Ta-da. That's a much better idea. <laughs> T 
Tiggy, for the love of God. Stop at the bridge. You bother me. I really hate that I had to kill those ground runners. It would have been really useful to tame up. But it's alright. It's alright. We'll, we'll deal. I know we don't have the stuff to deliver here, but this is a good spot for it. I'm gonna make sure the trees don't grow. I'm gonna cover the rest of this with potato. All we need to do is fill like one battery. In fact, we can also have a door there. Why not? I need a Easier way to get to the toilet. How you doing, Karen? I'm gonna have to raise you. Maybe not. You're 44 out of 42. It's a big old maybe. Everybody doesn't seem too sad about the. They don't care about eating raw food. It's because Tiggy's an aesthetic. That's why he doesn't care. Alright, I'm going to want a few windows there. Oh, we did get the door finished there. I didn't even mean to. Oh, darn. Oh, well. And kick him out. In you go. Okay. Boop. Uh, let's get a lamp. Let's get a latrine. And then forget you exist for a while. Yeah, we can't make these out of steel. All these power things don't have an option. Or we can't make these out of uh, copper and tin. We're going to have to actually find steel. The only steel I've found so far is way the hell over here. Uh, which is really unfortunate. But I need it. I'm gonna be getting any power and stop eating raw food. Here in his medical emergency. He's gonna be fine. He's 85 out of 80. I'm honestly like, he's missing a lung. I'm kind of tempted to just raise him anyway. Like. Shit, would it be better too? He wouldn't learn. We're still sleeping in sleeping spots. Oh, shit. Thank you. Tortured artist means that occasionally he would actually break, but then he would get an inspiration to make something really cool, like a chair or a bed. Nimble means he'd almost never get hit. I think it also gives a movement bonus. No, trap spring chance. Less, though. And Miss Andrews I can deal with. You know what? He is actually not too bad. He's just missing a lung and is addicted to mana potions. I think I'll keep him. You can live for now. For now. And yeah, the, the brick thrall is actually getting quite a bit of the potatoes done, which is perfect. Exactly what I wanted. Maxed out ray of hope. Squish leveled up again. I hate that I just basically city with neural interface forever. I 
mean, I guess I could also level, like, Kinetic Shield, which is pretty damn powerful. Uh, Overdrive is not going to be useful for a very long time. What is Sabotage? Overrides the target's mechanical fail safe slot. Yeah, that's just against Mechanoids. Uh, we should get the... The Empire quest today. The Visiting Count or whatever. Ah, finished off my my tea. Good stuff. I swear, I still I need like a, a a tea kettle like right next to me most days. Temperatures are staying pretty standard. Uh, we need to get a stockpile zone, which I'm gonna put right. That's a bad idea. I need to move the well. We can move it down here. That's fine. Uh, there we go. More Sentinels. And nope. Okay, now the Sentinel there. Uh, the bridge is almost done. Very small, but I can use that to my advantage. The well got destroyed, so let's go ahead and put a small area here for waste. And we'll just get the brick thrall to move that really quick. Or you just don't feel like it. Okay. Uh, everybody, your hall plus is now to two, except for Brick Thrall, who will take care of it first. Brick Thrall, hall plus this thing. There's a good abomination. Who's a good abomination? You are. Who just. You, I, there was like a puff of smoke that came off when he used the toilet. What was that? I don't know what that was. <laughs> that was weird. What is it? What does a skeleton do in the bathroom that creates a pop of smoke? The mushroom should last a little while. Yeah, spoils in 28 days. The problem with that is mm, fungus is despised in our colony. In a raw to negative six. Ugh. But I'll deal with it for now. Arrow Fleet has self tamed. I'll keep that. There we go. Quest available the solitary count. Oh, wow, there's a new thing here. This is a charity quest. If you don't fulfill it, believers in the former Magitech Empire will be unhappy due to their charitable beliefs. That's going to be a struggle. If you do, believers in the former Magitech Empire will be happy. And this also gives me plus one development point. Interesting. Angelos has joined. Uh, they can do nothing while they're here. It's, it's fine. They don't. They're not required to. But I'll put them on research just to get them out of the way. Any good psychic abilities? You're a paladin. You are also a wimp. You cannot hunt this vision mouse. Damn, you're really good, though. <laughs> Alright, where is this thing? It's that thing? It's not really coming after us. Um, you know what? Brick Thrall, go for it. Nobody, you know, here, grab this knife. Grab a better... Is, is, that a, is it a poor knife? Ah, it's a poor knife. Eh, hey, whatever, it's a knife. Go out to the fish and mouse. Stab it. Well, at least Tiki's enjoying the, food, enjoying the food right now. Uh, solar panels are done. Excellent. Let's move on to multi-splitter conditioning as fast as we can. Uh, the shuttle has arrived because that fish and mouse got here and changed his mind. Angelos, get in. Bye. And Squish, because we're not friendly with the Empire, will not give him a title just yet. Go.
Good job. The last wood bridge, Tiggs. You constructed this whole thing, but the last. A low psychic drone. It's fine. Whoo, look at him go through that. Yeah, there it is. Magicite. Hmm. It looks like Xeno's grabbing all the steel and delivering it right away, but we're not getting any components. <clears throat> and components I definitely didn't see around here. Damn. That's... Hmm. We're definitely going to have to start digging into the mountain, but I want to get all the steel first. Uh, Xeno's been hauling this whole time. Uh, and not growing, so let's get all of this started. Uh, that means more steel. That's enough on steel. Let's cancel that. Go with solar power instead. Because it's more reliable. And that's going to be a full nine components. What do we do about that? Usually you can find something around. Usually there's some exposed components somewhere. But nothing. It's granite. There's a little bit of steel right there. Do you have a quarry mod? I do. You the com the components from a quarry are ridiculously rare. At that point, I'd rather have brick thrall just dug dig straight in the mountain in the path I'm going to be taking anyway. You know. Which I kind of plan to do, but I want to get that steel first, or at least get enough steel to complete all of these things. My plan is get all of this done and enough for multi-split air conditioning and heating. We'll just get enough steel for just that. Um, let's get a... Hmm. That'd be a bad place to put that. There, and... We don't have multi-split air conditioning yet. Another point in cheating death for Xeno, which is maxed it out. Good, good, good. How is your regen? 019. Okay. One twenty five, one forty, one hundred, one hundred, one hundred. Okay. In that case, we are going to start digging into the mountain itself. Oh no, I need to get that ready. And that's about half. So let's make sure we have a little bit of steel finished out. Oh, that's enough. That's way more than enough. Thank you, Tiggy. Good job. Quarry Thrall would be good for resources. It would. It would. Uh, for now, let's do this. Because it's going to be a bit until we've got the components to finish that off anyway. I want to use this as uh, my main river snake defense. So I'm going to kind of want them to like... Have them come in here. Two, three, four, five. So we have like trap line. And then our shooting lines back here. And they'll have to go all the way through a twisting line there to get in. Ooh, that's bad. Um we'll just do like so. Mm -hmm. 
Do kill boxes like that still work that well? Um, I find it work really well. Uh, basically, they would come out here, and I'd have them go doop doop like this, with two spaces in between that they have to go through to get to me. They usually work pretty well for me. It's uh, one of the one of the things I enjoy doing the most, to be honest. Oh, Kieran's actually up and moving. Hey, buddy, how's it going? You like uh, you like religion? Yeah, me neither. Maybe it's just my games, but the AI just moves around them or dicks through them. Um, it, it depends. That's why I have them two cells apart. That way, uh, their movement speed is 30% when they're walking through here, so they know they're going to be much slower and it'll actually be faster to go through this. It's you got to kind of balance it uh, with the snake. Um, I'm actually going to cancel all uh, all of this twist and turning for now. Because it's going to be a while till we get to that point anyway. And that just seems like a waste of resources. There's a little bit of steel right here and somehow never registered with me. And let's get a crafting spot here. Where we can start making smoke leaf. Otherwise. I feel like I need to make clubs. For people. But I want them out of stone blocks and nothing else. Andrew Dan. If you would stop using our wood. <laughs> like we don't have many resources. Please don't use the wood. We're not really going to be able to regrow it for anytime soon in fact i'm gonna get another yet another growing zone and this one's gonna be pine tree i can't do pine tree i don't have pine tree resource uh, pine tree research done My people really don't want to eat this fungus. <laughs> They're just completely avoiding it. Uh, you might not have a choice, guys. Sorry. Yeah, I do need tree sowing research. I don't have it. I thought I did. I don't. We'll get it after multi-split air conditioning. That's not a big deal. We've got a researcher to start with. Oh, and I just noticed these trees are going to, like, provide a little bit of cover and slow people down there, and I don't want that. Get rid of those, please. Just all the trees. All those trees. Uh, refuse visitors until I have guest beds. They, they could, they're going to come in here and sleep on my floor and then complain at me because they want to sleep on my floor. I don't... Multi-split air conditioning is done. We're going to go right for tree sowing. And then make sure we have enough steel for the air conditioner unit, which I will put up here. Boom. Which that's a great place for it. Very proud of that spot. I'm weird. Ignore me. And that's actually a bad place for this. Um, like, it can go anywhere up here. <laughs> I don't know why it's such a big deal to me where it goes. Because I'm going to move it, and I can just connect it up with wooden pipe. I don't know why it's such a huge deal to me. <laughs> Being very odd. That's all there is to it. Are they just refusing to eat that fungus? 
I think they are. Nope. Oh yeah, Tiggy did it, but Tiggy don't like fungus. None of them do. Whoo, negative six. Oof. Who that negative six. I'm kind of wondering if, starting out, if I should give Squish the leader position or the priest position. All right, I'm gonna pause really quick here. I wanna start shaping out how the base is gonna be. Two, three. Uh, so we'll go with our normal 11 by 11 for the hospital. And that's going to connect right up to a prison. Which can connect to a freezer. Oop, one too far down there. Main hallway. Two, three, four, five. Cancel that. That's 11 by 11. And then we can use little spots around here for hydroponics. And then that right there can be the nutrient paste dispenser for the prison. Hey! Yeah, I like that. That's done. Um, oop, I harvested an exotic animal. I did what now? Ah, the blue gel from the arrow fleet. Yeah, yeah. Um, we are, what is it? Uh, marble granite? Yeah, we're actually marble granite, my favorite. Marble, do. Granite, do. Marble, do. That is two, five. 2,000, 2,000. Not like we have the labor to do it right now, but eventually we might. Yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna give Squish not a leadership position, but instead we'll go no ritual altar ideogram or ritual spot. Oh yeah, we need the ritual spot. I forgot we needed a temple! Poopy. We can go right here. Not a big deal. Doesn't even need to be big. Uh, da, 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 da. Where, where's her... Where's her, ide where's her ideogram? Eh. Oh my god, it's like one cell too high in both directions. That's obnoxious. Fine. Be annoying. Marble altar. Uh, lectern. Maybe we don't need a... Fine. You know what? Fine. It's all a temporary thing anyway. You're just making it difficult on me for just no reason. Ritual spot. And... Don't really have anything else to put there. Um, because we get the altar instead of the symbol on the ground. But this does mean we can go to Squish and start a role change to Kefka's Preacher. Let's begin! They don't seem to care if the leader role is unfulfilled, they definitely care if the Preacher role is unfulfilled. And that opens up a uh, conversion ritual, which I should do to Kieran, like, right away. Come on, Kieran, we're gonna put you on the ground and talk at you about, you know, 
how Kafka took over the world and destroyed the world at the same time, and now we're horrible people because of it. Drew's breakout. A prisoner is being held by the Great Meyer Settlement. Has managed to steal a radio and call you. And on uh, my cell phone. Drew is being held at the camp near the tomb with a holy minigun under armed guard. Rescue him. He will join your colony. He's a 33-year-old construction engineer? Two turrets, one mortar, two settlers. What? And an unknown threat. And he's Zeno's brother. We have to go after him, but oh my god. Masterful conversion ritual. Wow. Uh, wow. That That's good. That was good stuff. We could do scarification now, too. Um, shit. I'd bring Zeno, Brick Thrall, Andrew Dan. I think. That's such... I'd, have to, I'd bring Squish. I'd have to bring everybody but Tiggy. And he's like way over here. Everything in me is telling me not to do this. I mean, how we could bring Undead back with us, honestly. Everybody but Tiggy. This is this is ridiculous. We're not bringing the Ibex meat. We're bringing all the raw fungus. 2.6 days of food, 0 0.7 days to get there. Tiggy is staying with the raw meat, which he does not mind. He will have to be set on wardening temporarily to make sure Kieran remains fed. Brick Thrall is slower. Now he's moving to 122. Why is he looking so slow? Make sure everybody's leveled up as much as we can. All right. This this feels like a mistake. This feels like a mistake. Tiggy should be fine. Tiggy's got the Sentinel, so he needs to run and be protected. In fact, let's go put another one down. What do you mean not? The Sentinels will be easily able to protect Tiggy. He'll be fine. He can uh, keep fed for enough days until they get back. There's enough food. Yeah, he'll be fine. Kind of nervous over nothing right now, but... Two turrets and a mortar and an unknown threat. And two settlers. Like, this is such a bad idea. If this is a trap, boss, I request permission to raise my brother if he's a traitor. Permission friggin' granted. Oh, and while we're waiting on that, I actually do want to floor things up. Uh, there's a lot of speculation on whether flooring is really necessary early game because it's going to get dirty anyway. But I know that my, my colonists prefer to not have it dirty. So I'd like to floor it. Here we are. All right, there he is right there. There's a, there's a hexagonal mortar launcher. What the? Oh my God, this might be impenetrable. Like I see that there I do not there there's the other turret I I don't see the other colonists wasn't there supposed to be two settlers
All right, Fog of Torment. Okay, we can sabotage the turret. Self-destruction, catastrophic failure, even lost the ability to turn friend from foe. That's good, that's good. Okay, Brick Thrall, go out here first, get their attention. And then squish, hit that. Nice. Dynamite Fobby here. Good shot. Wait, wait, did, stop. Squish, stop. There we go. Stop throwing dynamite. Uh, kinetic shield, the brick thrall. What the hell was that? What the hell? Oh, the dynamite went off. Okay. Um, if we can get, like, one of these power conduits down... We're fine. Yeah, I expected you to kill him. I'm waiting for this dynamite to go off. Oh, I destroyed the body. Oh, boo. Uh, Squish has no more abilities left. Is that a mana? We need Squish to go forward while the brick... Squish! <laughs> Uh, that might do it, actually. Nope. Gotta hit this thing with some dynamite. But Brick Thrall needs to be up here to take its attention. I would love to take these, but I don't think that's gonna happen, so... We'll just destroy it instead for the components. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Squish is fully healed. Excellent. I want to use this door as cover if possible. So first off, we're going to jump in here. Hello. He's a psionic. Holy crap, he's a psionic. I'm going to free you. Recruit you. Open this door. What is that disgusting nutrient paste meal? That's just unfortunate. Go here, and then here. And then you just dynamite there. I wish that I could save this stuff, but I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, it still has power, damn. Like, I would love to save that mortal launcher, but... There we go. Wait for that to blow. Damn. I was really hoping to keep that. All right. Let's take these apart. These are the components I needed, and nobody's hurt. That's important. And we've now got Drew, who can uh, take apart all this stuff. So that actually went really well. Okay, now that we got all those taken apart, home again, home again. With all of this food. And that bedroll, because why the hell not? Nine components, which is enough for the solar panels. Uh, we got two reinforced barrels, which are very important for mortars. Steel, steel, standing lamps. Leave everything else. We can't carry it. Oh. We cannot take the mortar the mortar barrels. Uh, let's just leave behind the urns. We're gonna get enough. It's not a big deal. I mean, it worked out. It worked out really well. I didn't get the I didn't get the, uh, the turrets, which I really did want those turrets, and I did not get the mortar, which would have been amazing. But overall, I'm pretty satisfied with the results. One point eight days of food. One point eight days to get back. And we're going to have to convert him once we're back to. 
Uh, let's cancel those and just have just one solar panel. Because uh, the components we want to consolidate. And once we've got the cooler done, the, the heaters done, all that stuff, then I will consider where to go next. Kind of sad we didn't get those bodies. Tampa dead for transport? There's no bodies. We destroyed the only dead body there with dynamite. But having a constructor here so that Tiggy can concentrate on the digging. Perfect. Hey, Squish. Uh, we just did a remarkably, like a, a rescue mission that went remarkably well. Remarkably well. Really surprised it went that well. <laughs> but we rescued Xenomorph's brother, which we got to find a name for him. We have an animal undead. I can turn into a temp undead transport. That's true. That's true. But we didn't have any we didn't have any animal undeads there either. I I could have thought of uh, of grabbing one, I believe, but I didn't. Not a big deal. Everybody's happy. We just did a charitable thing. We saved Drew. I gotta think of a name for him. I gotta think of somebody to name him after. We got Kara and Pamanja. Always well, got those two. And he's gonna take over constructing while Tiki goes to digging. Which is a happy thing. We're out of food back at home. Um, it's gonna take him about two days to get here, so I'm gonna have to get Tiki to butcher that mouse. Which he's not gonna be good at it. If anyone wants to claim my brother, I'm okay with it as long as they stay his family. Alright, Tiggy, there you go. Uh, that should be all for now, and luckily you didn't have to go hunting, but you've got enough food to save Akira and enough food for yourself for at least a day. Should be good. Uh, but yeah. Uh, oh, hello. Animal transport pot crash. That might be some more food. Oh, we gotta rescue him. It's 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 a little raccoon. We've gotta rescue him. He's a, I I love raccoons. <laughs> His name is Ichabod. It's a raccoon named Ichabod. I'm already so happy. And if he doesn't want to join us, hey, I can eat raccoon. That's not a big deal. Somebody stabbed this raccoon and then shoved him in a transport pod and just shot him off in a random direction. Monsters. Found this on Reddit. Uh, guilty meme is top tier. Rescue animal didn't join. Yeah, come on. An interesting twist, the guilty meme, one of the five memes you can start with, is significantly more powerful for fluid ideologies. This is due to it giving you both the precept pain is I stop that. Pain is idealized, which is critical for making a scarification which will usefully spammable. And because precepts charity gives you access to a bunch of easy ways to increase development points because all charitable acts including the completion of quests will give yeah we already got one point for that actually that's true i've got three already <laughs> and a wild man has wandered in hello who are you justinian the guy from a romance novel 60 years old. Can't do combat. Misandrist lazy. Uh, but social. Like, that's some good social skill, and we do need... He's frail. No, we're ignoring him. He's frail. 
Screw you, Justinian. Wild man who can do social. Wild man is like, at some point you became disillusioned with civilization. And decided to go live in the wild. There we go. Caravan's home. Literate wild man. I mean, it's it doesn't mean, uh, like, wild man does not mean he's dumb. Alright, Drew. Uh, Krishna's cult. Can I turn wild man into labor? You can. That's a great idea. <laughs> Let's kill him. Alright, this guy is volatile and psionic. Um, cannot, cannot really do good social, but damn, look at all the psionic abilities. I'm gonna name this, this is gonna be Pramonja. Nah, let, Kara's the, the, the latest one, so we'll go with Kara. And we'll do some quick things here. Get rid of the beard. Where's the... Where is no beard? Get rid of the beard. No beard. There we go. Uh, body. There we are. Female. This is now Kara. Uh, let's... Brother Zeno. I'm gonna have to go to Zeno here and, uh... Okay, now it says sister. Good, 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 good. Kara, welcome to the colony. Just where I wanted you to be. Uh, volatile means that they will get angry at the drop of a hat. I don't everything and we'll have mental breaks much faster but that's okay we will deal with it because otherwise they're amazing all right kara you are also a shooter we don't have any weaponry at all but because you are a great constructor we are actually going to take tiggy off constructing in fact, I think I'm going to give you the Xeno's gun. So that you could take over hunting, too. Yeah, let's do that. And I put you there. Uh, how are we doing on the conversion ritual? 17 days. Good. Squish, if you would go and try and convert. Start working on that. Woo, 95 to 42. Whew. Not bad. Oh, we need to take Xeno off of hunting now. There we go. I'm looking at all these things just going, that's so much stuff. Be very persuasive. Yeah, you can. And we need to look at the psionic abilities. Kara's got every psionic ability and is ready to learn more. God. Um, oh yeah, isn't psionic like a physical thing? Crush an opponent with raw power. This only occurs in combat, can be used in cohesion without the combat abilities. Minimum target range of five slots. Yeah, it's a melee thing. I forgot about that. They're melee, except for psionic storm. Let's down all mental barriers, unleashes their unrestrained psionic power. Due to the nature of this attack, the psionic will expand a tremendous amount of energy and be left vulnerable, unable to exert psionic power for a period following the end. They basically go comatose. Um, there's dash, blast, which is a ranged ability, but I think augmentation is what I want to go for. It's a might ability. It's a combat thing. I forgot about that. So they actually do want to go melee. Yeah, basically Psychic Berserkers. So, swap back. No hunting there. Hunting there. I forgot they're basically melee. Not sure about the Protoss comparison. Um, it is a big Protoss comparison because they got the dash, they got the blast, they got the barrier, they got the storm. It's exactly what they are. Requires two points to level. Okay. Augment movement. 
Sonic is able to rapidly accelerate the movement for a short time. Um, I feel like I should work on Storm first. Yeah, they're basically like Protoss. It's, it's a mixture of the Protoss stuff. Which I think is honestly pretty badass. Kara tamed Ichabod. I like it. I do. We're getting potatoes! Hooray! Uh, we are down one component to finish that off, but we've got the solar generator, the electric boiler up. With the electric boiler and Andrew Dan getting us granite means that we have enough marble. So let's go for a large radiator, get our heat going. Thank you, Andrew Dan. It's like a mix of Protoss, Zealot, and Psyker. Pretty much, yeah. All we need is an Arbiter to recall Ultralis and BNB Faction's base. Uh, that can be anybody, actually, because we can get the Teleport ability, which is basically that. Alright, I need to... I need to see what this does. <laughs> Did you all see that? That was incredible. I'm not even sure what just happened. Squish is very upset, apparently, and wants to throw rocks at me. It's a marble meteor, which I can actually use. And uh, Xeno's doing the same thing. Oh, yeah, wow. Oh. Sky Steel. Hi. That, that was... Weird, but cool. <laughs> wow. Okay, I gotta look at temperatures. It's the 13th of December in summer, because we're in the Southern Hemisphere. Temperatures are actually staying pretty good right now. I forgot that was supposed to... Yeah, okay. Well, we don't have enough for that anyway, so I don't care putting up another one here. Because, like, we got our one electrical conduit right there to attach everything. Uh, that's getting power, which is powering this thing, which brings it up to 70, and then slowly lets over off its heat over time, which is good. Are we going to restart seven days to die next week? Yes, absolutely planning to do that. Um, my plan was to basically wait until Tiki has a day off. That way we can all go into it at the same time. I did plan to do it last week, but then things happened. Tree sewing is done. I forgot I was doing tree sewing. Um, what do I want next? Is it magic time? Smithing. It's always smithing. We need smithing. I was. I always need to do smithing. So Tiggy being aesthetic means that, like, being around the ugly stuff, he loves it. Being an optimist, he will never break. We need to get him a pickaxe. Oh, hi, Justinian. Forgot about you. Thank you for coming to remind me. Nobody pay attention to this. 
Not important. We just got a new friend. It's not a big deal. Uh, his his name? It's not Justinian. It's uh, uh. Labor thrall. Where to find him? Had him with me this whole time. What are you talking about? He's always been here. He is actually better at the cooking, at the butchering. Okay. He can help plant. Don't need to do that. But what he can do is take over the cleaning and hauling while Brick Thrall is doing other things. In fact, let's make sure he does that before the growling. I wonder if there's a class that has abilities like the Zerg, the Technomancer could like Terran from StarCraft. Um, kind of like we've got psionics. Um, we got, we got psionic power, you know. Um, then there's the Black Hive, but which we can't play, but are pretty much what you're thinking of, I believe. Hell, I mean, there's a there's a vanilla faction storyteller for Empress Evil. <gasps> Increase the rate of fire by 10% per skill point. I didn't even realize what this did. All right, I, I need to see this again. We're going to go to 1x speed. Wow. That's insane. That is so crazy. <laughs> we need to get Smith in and get her armor. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is the coolest damn thing. Maxed out Ray of Hope. We need to check everybody here. Been a while. A couple days at least. Nope, nothing. Okay. Ooh, we got rituals. Kefka's fair is expected. Uh, we could do ignoble cuttings too. We need an altar built, and we're nowhere near that. Uh, let's get a, another one of these outside just in case there's like a dance party we can do or something out here. We can do the celebration of sin. I don't remember what that is. Any effigy. Oh, right, the sacrificial pyre. Uh, we don't have any cloth to make it out of. The air fleet's sporulated. We have more aero fleets now. The cotton just got planted, so we can't do the fair of Kefka, uh, Kefka's fair. But uh, we can do an ignoble cutting. Uh, Squish can do it to Tiggy. We should have an altar first, though. And since we now have somebody who is separate and who's doing nothing right now, uh, let us make some wooden pews here. While Andrew da you know what? No. Marble. Let's make a marble. Damn, go Tiggs. Could I temp permission to post a quick mod that might interest you? Uh, yeah, hold on. Just uh, allow... I think it's allow, right? Unrecognized command. I forget what the command for that is. Andrew Dan Squish, you want the command to allow links? I mean, you can always post it on the Discord. Smithing got done really quickly. We immediately want to move on to plate armor. Now, do I have it powered or fueled? I feel like I should have it electric. Should we do techni- We don't have the components. Yeah, that's fine. We can do it that way.
Yeah, post it on Discord. We'll look at it there. Also, I'm gonna destroy these up and replace them. Let's see. Psionic Lich? Hold on. Pause. Psionic liches are undead psionic users, usually scions, and sometimes psionic monsters who have entered their mentality into the necrotic tissue of their once living bodies, thus preserving their existence. So it's just a lich, but not magical. Uh, da, 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 da. Probably be rendered unconscious for a few days when the transformation takes place. Psychokinesis, psychometabolism, shadow and augmentation. One is a social negotiation and trade. Lifesteal is similar. I'm not honestly seeing much of a point. I mean, it's it, it seems honestly normal, but like I'm not seeing much of a point in having it. Normal beds. Well, that got done really quickly. Holy crap. We need three pickaxes. And then... Anything else? Whoa, 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 whoa. Not copper. No, 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 no. No alloys, no alloys. No alloys. Just, just steel. Right, we need to get plate armor researched, but I can make shields. I think this requires leather? Wood and ingredients. Yeah, wood and leather. So let's make four of them. Druid has some Zerg like skills. Like what? Basically, a different version of a necromancer with some abilities for other classes. Yeah, that's kind of what I saw, is it's just a mixture. It's like a, a lich with chaos mage, basically. Uh, let's get these moved out of here. I forgot to set this to trees. Get that harvested, or get that started, get that planted. Uh, which it's five degrees outside, so we're gonna have to start the harvest soon, which is unfortunate. I was really hoping to get some cotton out of this year. Drew this poison, regen, coax animal, cure disease. Not sure those are Zerg like. You know what, I'm actually gonna... Nope, those are... I already got the things on them. Okay, that's fine. Car can take care of it. Car, why are you... Oh, no. Only Faith... Oh. She doesn't have the right... She, she can't do it. We need to convert her first. Car, come back here. There we go. Two times. Wow. <laughs> Two times for the conversion and she's on our side. That's that's impressive. What is the recall spell? I don't know. I don't remember. I'm very devout. <laughs> Okay, Tiggy. Uh, let's see. We got. Oh, there's a good one. And then normal and normal for you two. Ooh. You better. Okay, it's it's wood and leather. It's wood and leather. I don't. I don't have to worry. Wood and leather. Oh, listen to that. That is some fast mining. He left right as I told you to listen to it. That's Tiggy. You got to help me out, buddy. Well, the 
kite shields are done. Uh, can, I should be able to get them. Tiggy, did you already get one? Yeah, you already got one. Okay. Uh, let's get the thralls. Where is the other one? Plate armor got finished really quickly. Oh my god. I would normally say Devil Strand or Alloy Forge right now. Maybe Alloy Forge is actually not a bad idea. No, we don't have components. Fuck. Maybe magic. Maybe magic's the way to go. But we don't have cotton. Jumpsuits. There should have been another thing here. Maybe somebody else grabbed it. Yeah, Kara grabbed it. No? Somebody grabbed it. Anyway, uh, we need to make armor for everybody and then start on winter clothing. What is ignoble cutting? Ignoble cutting is scarification. We need, a, we need an altar for it, but everybody wants it. Um, let's make... Nope, can't do that. Okay. What about regular plate? We can do regular plate for Squish Kara. Anybody else melee that desperately needs it? Andrew Dan is a paladin. So, plate armor for the three of you, and we will make... Ravager helmets or plate helmets? Let's go ahead and make them full suits of plate. Um, heavy plates. Can't make heavy plate. Okay, Ravager helmets it is. Oh. Ugh, thank you, Andrew Dan. Mm. You want a heavy shield. What's a heavy shield? Like guardian helmets? They're not bad. Yeah, we'll do guardian helmets. Nope, can't do guardian helmets. Uh, regular plate? Nope. What what level is Andrew Dan? Maybe by the time we get there. Nope, he's five. Okay. <sighs> Ravager? Ravager we could do. Okay. Did we get some sky metal? We haven't mined it out yet, but we do have it. I didn't want to I didn't want to use it until Andrew Dan was in a much better uh, crafting ability. Uh, and we do want to do we cannot do we can do not do the electric tailing bench because it takes two components. So we'll start with just a regular hand tailoring bench. Right there. Andrew Dan's got a lot of work to do. Like, the sky metal's not going anywhere. If I got it, it would just arbitrarily raise my wealth for no reason, and I don't want to use it yet, so there's no point in mining it out. It's fall. I gotta watch the temperatures. Actually, no, I don't. We're cutting it all. Uh, let's not cut the cotton. Like, if it's not grown, if I can't harvest it, there's no reason to cut it down. The, 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 the potatoes, yes, most of the potatoes are ready. Nothing else is. Imagine if our seven days to die base looked like this with stuff on the floor all the time. So, like, don't starve. Would you be interested in a mod that's some monster hunter monsters, weapons, and armor that has pawn morpher capability? I saw that one, actually. And I used it for a little bit. Stop. Um, but, like, I was never brave enough to go after any of the monsters. <laughs> God, look how fast he's going with that pickaxe. Is it any good? Um, the monsters were honestly pretty balanced. I was a coward. 
<laughs> I didn't go after them ever. Kieran, are you like... Wait, did you actually get... Are, are you converted? Yeah, you are. When did that happen? Okay. Did you find Tiggy an auger or something? It seems like it. Look at him go. There's some steel there, I'm seeing. Kara just changed her hair. We're out of wood. Oh, no. And it's fall, so we got to get a lot. There you go. Zeno got all the potatoes. Let's get those inside. Yeah, you converted Kara's second try. That was incredible. Oh, my God. She is back there screaming for attention. I'm not allowed to talk. Hello. Not you. Get down. Every single time I give any animal attention, Willow has to butt in. Typical dog. Oh, I totally messed up my camera. Okay, there we go. Alright, there's the wood, Kara. Got the... Got that done really fast. I keep, like trying to go with these people, but they're so fast. Oh. Uh, that's 50. So that means we gotta set this to 200. It's not gonna change much, but it means if I want to get anything done, I've gotta kinda be a little bit better than we have been. And boop. There we go. More more research there. I always put my Technomancers to, to crafting, and now I'm realizing, holy crap, research. Oh my god. I saw that Ultra shirt. Yeah, you love, yeah, I, I love that Ultra, I love the Ultra shirt. It's actually got like, it's, it's a kind of a whole thing of uh, monsters from Final Fantasy VI. The best game ever. All right, the hand tailoring bench is done, but Andrew Dan is da, 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 smithing is before tailoring. Okay. So for the people who are currently going to be melee and they're going to be in plate mail instead of the chest plate, we need to make sure that they get cloaks because those are the only things that they can wear to keep them warm during the winter. And it's going to get up to negative 30. I found a sort of resurrector mod there's a health trait called Celestial. They can resurrect if da if dead after a while and can regenerate lost body parts. That seems broken as fuck. <laughs> That's so broken. Oh my god. Uh, what else do we want? Uh, we can go with pants, t-shirts for everybody, and then the rest of everybody, which is two people, gets parkas. So we go to six, because uh, Kieran, what are you? You are shooting. Okay. Omni, remember a colony killer portal can spawn. I actually found out a better way to take care of those. Uh, apparently, if you wait them out, the portal will disappear. You just defend. Um, <laughs> I had no idea. Oh, we only need four. Yeah. Nope, Xeno's also melee three. Um, it was a little embarrassing to find out because... Oh my god. Samantha, I am not paying attention to you. Stop. Um, if you go after them and you do end up actually destroying the portal, you get augmenting gems. You get enchanted gems, which are amazing. But if you don't, and you can't handle it, you can wait it out. 
and it'll go away. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> There's the ship to the stars, which I don't want to do. It is now negative three outside, so I gotta watch the temperatures, even though this is keeping us warm. We can up the power there. I'm probably gonna want another one of these. So let's build another one. Um, oh, and Kara, you should probably make one of them. Andrew Dan leveled up again. Uh, maxed out Ray of Hope right now means that we're going to move on to... I'm thinking Valiant Charge next, but heal is really good. I'm going to wait for Valiant Charge. Andrew Dan, what are you doing? You doing what I told you? How dare you? Damn it! It's fucking copper! I keep forgetting about the damn alloys! No alloys! Just make it out of steel! Oh my god. Copper isn't in alloys. Copper is not in alloys because you don't put it together. We don't really have steel. We have a little bit. We've got enough. All right. Copper. Tin. Just going to make sure to take this off. Everything now. You know what? No. I should let him make it out of copper. It's not going to be great, but it'll be enough for a little while. And I can probably use that steel in other places. Rather than concern myself right now with it, you know? Yeah, it's fine. I feel like my new neighbors upstairs stomp when they walk. Having lived here before, I don't think it's just the thin walls my previous neighbor was fine. Or they just didn't move around that much. Your previous neighbor just might not have moved around that much. I don't know, there were so many Fallout-based mods apparently in the workshop. Uh, yeah. Fallout's a big thing. Uh, yeah, Heart of Stone. There we go. That is... Can we get more Sentinels now? Nice. Wait, I thought we... Stop it! I'm not paying attention to you because you're destroying things. <sighs> uh, okay, we gotta make sure that only the right people wear these clothing. Uh, so squish, plate gloves, helmet. That is not attached to plumbing yet, that's fine. I want to start storage options here because I don't know where everything is. So let's do medicine here. Oh, no. I want to be able to find things once they're done. Oh my god. Fingers. Fingers. Stop. There. Jeez. How about misclicks? Do you like misclicks? Yeah. Uh, that should be good for a while on, on wood. Yeah. Kara will get these done the second that she wakes up. Andrew Dan is still working. There's all the Ravager helmets done. Uh, let's make sure Kara... Yeah, I don't even know where the rest of the stuff went. Somebody's weren't... Yep, there's the boots. Uh, Tiggy is wearing gloves and boots. Thralls didn't put anything on, of course, but, you know, gotta check. 
And Dan doesn't wear anything, so Squish, you need boots. Kara, you need gloves and... Ooh, work attire got finished. Excellent! Now I gotta think what to do next! Uh, <laughs> crap. No? Yeah. We'll do Alloy Forge. It's fine. It's fine. It does mean, though, canceling the t-shirts and the pants. We didn't even do pants. We did parkas twice. That's fine. Jumpsuits for everybody. Yay! Who's missing boots? You are. A drought. Oh, well, that doesn't matter, actually. Uh, it doesn't matter that we got a drought. It's going to kill all my plants, but we're about to go into the winter season anyway. So let's just harvest this all up. Not used to such fast research? No, I'm not. All right. Allow all. Allow all. No tainted. And allow all. And then we will do it like this to get it all in place. You gonna take a nap? All right, Squish. Good luck on the nap. I have had difficult times with that lately. There's a bird skin cloak that I would like to go to Kara because she is out. Squish, put it on. It's fine. It's fine. Why are we not making plate armor? Andrew Dan, you know that's under acquired skill seven. Really? Brick Thrall. Oh, okay. Brick Thrall will make copper plate. Oh, okay. All right, who put the cloaks on? Come on, people. Uh, Xena was supposed to have a cloak. That's fine. There it is. There it is. Take that off. All right, Kara, get the cloak. Hopefully this keeps them warm. Underneath their plate mail, you know. All right, we are getting a lot of resources here. That's exactly what I wanted because now we have a drought, so we're not gonna have be able to do any replanting. Uh, Kara, what you doing? Eating raw potatoes? Okay. Why don't you work on this wooden plumbing there? Thank you. And that means I can actually close that off. Being changed to melee. Shit, I forgot you're not melee. It was Andrew Dan who's melee. Oh my gosh. There, it was the Paladin. It's because of the order you guys were in. I usually keep my melees up front here. Oh, Labor Thrall put on the baseball cap. That's adorable. I am suddenly... Uh, God, RimWorld. Nothing makes me question my motives like RimWorld. Oh, that goes right into the... Damn, that sucks. Oh, well. Uh, I don't need a shield. Yeah, but you have one, and I don't know why. You equipped that on your own. I didn't tell you to. Here, let's actually take that off. I don't even know why you have that. Uh, Andrew Dan. Uh, yeah, unusable with double action revolver. You can have it. Uh, Brick Thrall, finish. Why were you doing that over your... Why were you doing stone cutting over smithing? That's weird. We're going to want to make better weapons after this. We got a little bit of claw. Ooh, which I should immediately use. 
for this. Even though we missed the opportunity. No, we can begin Kafka's Fair. Or the Fiesta. Maybe I picked it up in the rescue mission. No, we made a bunch. I don't know why you picked it up. I was trying to give them to the Thralls and uh, Squish, but... They didn't. They, they put them down, like, right away. Kafka's Fair or Fiesta of Kafka? We can do both. Lure a venerated animal. We can lure a venerated animal. We can make another one. This doesn't warm up the room. Interesting. That was boring. Oh. Negative one mood. No. All right, let's do another. Fiesta of Kafka. Recharge 50 to 100 mana. Um, There's not really anything that people can do that uses mana right now that I'd want to do. Like, Xeno we can have just quickly just go kablam Fog of Torment a couple times to get some experience in that. And then run through it, apparently. Uh, Tiggy, we can... Summon another one of these. Now we're done at 25. Okay. That's fine. And yeah, let's do the Fiesta. See if we get a mood bonus from this. Don't the burning need to be outside? Otherwise, they don't do as well. I have never heard that. I assume it would say so? I don't know. That one was fun. Okay, that's plus five for six days. Excellent. The Alloy Forge gets finished. Cool. Uh, and we, go, we want to go Long Blades next. All participating mages have recharged 50 mana. Good. Uh, here's some cloaks. Uh, get this. Get that normal birdskin cloak. And Andrew Dan, get this plain leather. We probably want to make them out of something better, like Muffalo Wool. Oh my god. Are you melee? No? Take it the fuck off! There we go. You can't wear the cape with it? Oh man! Uh, right, that was just a mod that was for aesthetics. Shit, what do they wear to get warm then? Tabards. That was it. Tabards. And we want to make the tabard out of something really nice, so it's got to be wools. No leathers. Cloth should be okay for now, but I'm going to want to get some wools. Which means I want to look and maybe go kill some muffalo or tame the muffalo. You need to buy a tabard in D&D? You have one, actually. You just need to tell me what's on it. Are we still on unstable food stock? We absolutely are, because we have no components. And, I mean, I suppose I could get the fueled stove? Might as well, honestly. Start making some meals. Until we get components, there's nothing really else we can do. Yeah, basically with D&D, &D, if you want a tabard, you start with one. That's it. It was kind of in your backstory. Blue primary, white silver secondary with Bahamut's holy symbol on it. Okay. I mean, is it... Is it chevron? Is it... Uh, is, it is it... Is it... It's split? Is it lines? Okay, now who is going to be doing the cooking? Zeno. Xeno's our cook. Somebody else can butcher. We'll let Xeno cook. Um, if you can... 
Uh, fine meals up to 16. If not, simple meals. Yeah, you're just hauling right now, so you don't even have any. You don't even need to be doing anything. It's negative three outside. Let's go ahead and put some windows up to share the temperature with the outside. Uh, the parkas are done. Everybody's wearing one that needs one. Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wood? No. Let's not do wood. Let's not do wood and plate mail. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, yeah. That's fine. In fact, Brick Thrall, go ahead and get back to work. I know I told you to do this, but Labor Thrall can do that on their own. There's no suitable pen for Muffalo One. Um, we could do something about that, I think. Let's get a hayloft. Pen marker. Right there. Oh, what's going on? A monumental blueprint. Stellark. Oh, the Stellark themselves. Irene Lascaris of Dominion of Lebes is requesting that you build a monument to commemorate her plant growing skills. I am... You know what? She's the Stellark? I don't... I don't question it. 4x6 for 34 goodwill. I will do this. It's not even that big. We can put it right over here. There we go. Make sure that's set to hay. Good. And let's haul out the hay from here. It's not that much, but it should be enough for a couple muffalo. And an earthquake has hit uh, over there, so it's not actually hitting anything. Also, surprisingly, even though the drought hits, uh, we're still getting a little bit in cotton. Which is totally unexpected. There we go. Car is bringing in Muffalo 1. No, it's e <laughs> my heel root. Oh, that's not okay. W but there's hay right there, buddy. Okay, uh, let's go to... Uh, uh, Yeah, refining. Oh man, why do you gotta be like this? Stop, you monster! <gasps> He's just eating all my he, he ate all my heel root. Oh my god. Okay, we still got a little bit. There was chem shine. He was going nuts on the chem shine. I forgot that muffalos go crazy on chem shine. All right, everybody. Chem shine party. A low psychic drone has hit us, but that's okay. We got chem shine in us. Almost done with this armor. Brick thrall, where are you going? What? What, what do you? Oh, hygiene made you stop. Okay. There we go. Uh, normal copper plate got done. Let's go to Kara. And it looks like Andrew Dan's gonna get steel, which is so much better, and I'm okay with that. Right, we were getting Valiant Charge, one of my favorite abilities. Oh, I forgot about this thing. Uh, wood, 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 marble. Oh, wow, it's been a long time since we had a raid. The Orange Bramble Bandits are nearby and attacking immediately. They have a 
entertainer with them, which is not threatening whatsoever, I'm going to ignore them. We got Sentinels. Hey, you better run. Actually, I'm not going to ignore them. I'm coming out here. Yeah, they're going to throw down the Sentinels almost right away, but uh, we're going to try and go after them. There is no cover that will help you here. No squish! <laughs> no, there's a prisoner there too, no! Well, there was. All right, we don't have anywhere to put bodies. Go dump them in the river. Probably eat them. All tainted apparel and corpses, not mechanoid. And then make that a low priority, so that takes rotten. <sighs> Let's go with Gladiuses for everybody. How about... Wait, did we find some components somewhere? Where'd that come from? That was weird. Posted a modern room world that might interest me. You're gonna make me sad, aren't you? By the way, right below Rimworld, there's a Rimworld's mods thing. Ignorance is bliss. Uh, updated, recompiled, and refixed, re-uploaded Dimitri's. Uh, da, 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 da. By default, your effective tech level will be calculated as the highest tech level where you've completed 25% of the research, and enemies more than one tech level above this won't raid you. Really? I didn't know that. However, this is fully customizable with options. Set a fixed tech range for raid fact, or is that's one of the features of this mod? And meh. Meh. It's, it's not that important to me. Like, that's how I get guns. God, listen to him go. Tiggy, you're a madman. Oh, the altar's done. Uh, we can begin the ignoble cutting. And we got Muffalo 2. Uh, looks like Squish is going to get the first cutting. Basically, if you're tribal, next one raid you. Yeah, I know, but like, I've never found that to be a huge problem if you know how to, if you know how to handle it, you know. Ah. Huh? Ah. Okay. Basically, Squish has to have a ritual there first. After the ritual is done, Squish is taken and a medical procedure is performed on him to give him scarification. The speech felt quite meaningful. And the scarification technique was precise and dignified. Everyone gains a plus one mood for six days. Can I do that right away? I can. Oh my. Uh, scarification itchy. Why is it itchy? And it's only a plus one. Why is it itchy? It makes no sense. Hey, Zeno, why aren't you cooking? You're the, you're the cook, buddy. Come on. Uh, no components, but we got some plasteel. Alright, how is our ideology? We're at 6 out of 10. Not bad. Higher game difficulties, they'll slaughter you if you don't prepare carefully. That's why you... Okay, RimWorld is all about preparing carefully. 
It's all about preparing for what possibilities may hit you. Like right now, I have no defenses. That's an enormous mistake. <laughs> I'm fully aware that's a bad idea. That's why I'm giving my people armor and such. Um, and the Sentinels. And uh, when it comes to Mechanoids, uh, Squish has got his abilities. Why is everybody unhappy? Oh, the drone, yeah. Uh, the tabards are finished now. I need to make sure the tabards are only worn by. Uh, they're all gone already. Okay, Andrew Dan has a tabard, which is fine. No, he's got a cloak. No, he's got a tabard and a cloak. Where's the tabards, guys? Where are the tabards? Did I only make one on accident? I might have. I did a travel start, my first raid with a centipede with four scythers and one of those flame bot guys. I find that very hard to believe. There's no way they'd have enough raid points for your first raid. On the outline is the secondary color. So on the outline, I don't, okay. Uh, white, silver, secondary. Pattern's pretty simple. I posted it in media. Okay. Okay. This is important. Oh, it's just a... It's a... Uh, Persevent? I don't remember. Match that refining's done. Go to scribing. It's almost done. So close. Okay. We got the tabards, but only one is here. Kara got one. Good. There, that'll keep them a little bit warm in their armor. And... Done. Okay, Andrew Dan, you get some armor. And now we can start making gladiuses, and then make sure everybody's got shields. You've got a shield, you got a shield, you got a shield. We're good. The monument is done. Uh, if any piece is destroyed, this Dalek's reinforcement system will activate and one insect type will burn up from underground. One is not bad, but also I don't care about this thing, so I can just ignore it for now. I always forget the names of the Tabard Heraldry. We don't have Arashana here anymore to tell us. There's one Gladius. Uh, go ahead and grab that so we don't throw dynamite anymore. Are you, like, anywhere near breaking yet? Resistance 2.3. Okay, good. Oh, we need batteries. Oh, you don't say. Uh, let's go ahead and start another cutting. Uh, Squish does not need another cutting. The cutter is Squish. Uh, I, get, I think Tiggy got it last time, actually. We'll get Xeno one now. Did you get one? Satisfying scarification scarified. Okay. Yes, that was aching. Eleven percent pain. Oh my god. Find me a mod that makes it so the scars don't hurt. Do you use the interaction bubbles mod? Uh. Yeah. And I also use the speak up mod. Of course I do. It's hilarious. And it was boring. Why? Did, did Squish repeat himself? Is that it? Um, God, we need batteries so bad. I could... Yeah, let's cancel this since it is winter. And I'll just put that in there. I'll put the components in here, and we'll just use the battery here to keep everything warm. I don't even know why I was doing it another way. 
We didn't need. We don't need that right now. You got the speak up romantic update? I have not gotten the romantic update yet. No, I need to get that. I forgot. All right, Kara, get your breakfast. And then construct this as fast as possible so we get as much power during the day. Okay. Uh, no, no copper. Sorry, sorry. I keep forgetting. Uh, not doing the deserter because I actually want to be friends with the Empire. Okay, so hopefully this keeps us going at night. We're only using 500 watts of power. Can turn this off, it's not even doing anything. I just need so many components. Uh, let's do another one, let's give Kara some scarification. Everybody wants scarification, so there's no reason for me to hold back, you know? Um, I should probably work on getting helmets for Xeno and Tiggy next. Um, we could go with simple helmets or leather helmets. I think simple helmets are fine. And made out of whatever. Bye! Spectacular. Okay. Anybody else want one? Two of them. Two, two more. Brick Thrall wants one. And so does Labor Thrall. What? Uh, they... I don't know. That's weird. Could I get a wizard hat? It wouldn't really help you at this point. It would help with the Fog of Torment. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, let's go with that instead of the helmets. Let's go with th two wizards. Ha I don't remember if Kieran is anything spectacular. No, nothing. Okay. Uh, in that case, Kieran can get whatever hat they find. Uh, the gladiators are done. Excellent and a poor. Both made of steel. It's perfect. And Brick Thrall is back to working on bricks. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. Alright, everybody's awake. Let's make sure everybody is equipped with a Gladius because you still have a dagger. And you still have a revolver. And then make sure, yeah, y'all got kite shields. We're in good shape. Good. Uh, do we need anything else? For our armored people and unarmored people. I mean... What's Andrew Dan's crafting at? Because if it gets up higher, it's at 6 right now. When it gets higher, we can go with chain mail and stuff like that. For now, we'll just turn that off. There's one hat, a wolfskin wizard hat, and you better believe that wolfskin wizard hat is going right to Zeno. Why would it go anywhere else? How are we doing? Six out of ten. Okay, scarifications do not count towards ideology points. Immense blueprint. Seven by three for goodwill. Fine. Sure. They just, they want to decorate my home with blueprints, apparently. Um... Sure. And there's a light leather wizard hat, which I'll throw in a Tiggy. If 
fact, let's go get some more Sentinels up. And I just realized Tiggy is still on Wardening. Please stop that. <laughs> you is not Warden, boo. Um, we need to get Master Craftsmen for more powers. Two ability points per. I forgot that technically Tiggy is melee because I gave him the, the pickaxe, but that's kind of just how things are right now. What? There we go. Squish immediately talked to Kieran and immediately broke the resistance. More levels, more levels. Wow, that was fast. Must not destroy it for at least 15 days, of course. Who put potatoes in there? Don't be weird. Uh, four days to another conversion ritual. Although, I don't think we need to convert anybody anymore. We can do the Celebration of Sin, though. Zero to two development points depending on quality. A lit campfire or ritual spot. Spot must be in roof with at least 25 unroofed cells in the area. What can I do to make it better? Nothing. Let's just go. We're just, uh, making lanterns. Watching our plants die of the cold in the negative 17 temperature. Who's down here right now? Why are you guys inside? What are they doing? That was weird. Yeah, it was unimpressive because only four people showed up. Everybody else was inside. I didn't get any development points for that because everybody was just wasting my time. That was weird. Scribing's done. Advanced scribing. Uh, also, I feel it is time to get some storage options started here. Get a little bit messy. Brick wise. God, look at Tiggy go. That's not even his maximum speed he can go right now. Now, Kara has got a Gladius and a shield. I could give her a regular hammer, which would make her. Uh, Oh no, my heel roots get hit by blight. Oh no. Um, which would make her build faster. Really? I just filled that thing. Monsters. Fine, let's furniture, animal sleeping spots. Kieran finally joined us! Kieran, you are... Another constructor. I forgot. I forgot about you. But you will be Pomonja. <laughs> and hey, it's another shooter. We, we've got a lot of constructors going now. Pomonja, welcome to the colony. Thank you for subscribing on YouTube. You're greatly appreciated as always. Uh, you can mine. That is good, uh, but you are a shooter, so we want to get you a gun. There is an auto pistol, and uh, we could get you this double action. And Turtle is here, lurking in the chat, and decided now is the time to throw rocks at me. I think that's Turtle. Fat Rabbit, I don't, I don't remember. Anyway, how you doing today? You want a colonist? Okay. And it is steel. Necessary. Need it. Thank you. Oop. Let's get that. I love components, but take what I can get.
Uh, we could do another ignoble cutting on them, actually. Yeah, let's let's do that. You wanna you wanna claim this new builder that we just had join us? Turtle, you're more than welcome. Is there a generic summon or minion spell? Yes, actually, there is. You'll take him? Okay. Tiny fat rabbit. <laughs> I love that name. I really do. And let's cut you. Yeah, spectacular. Beautiful. Okay, so let's see. We've got this. Paste that. Put that as preferred. Copy. Paste, paste, paste. And get the labor thrall. Start pulling stuff in. Uh, sorry if you don't like skeletons. Uh, we got a few. You know, the whole necromancer thing. Oh, no! I forgot we could... We could totally afford to get more skeletons. Um, these bodies are still in good shape, but they're about to go bad. How is your magic? I think you can handle one more. We'll see if you can handle that one. Once your magic returns to normal, once you get over the arcane weakness. Come on. There we go. Uh, 0 0.9. Yeah, that's as, that's as low as I will reasonably go. Okay, we got a new thrall. You are another labor thrall. Sure. You can always use more labor thralls. Copy, paste, and assign to undead. All right. Andrew Dan's on a flirting frenzy. Please don't flirt with the skeleton. I know you were just making breaks next to him. Please don't do that. All right, let's get the labor thralls working. Get all the stuff hauled out of here and then change this to get cleaned. Oh, there's even more steel. Ooh, that's a large amount. Still wish it was components, though. Now, there's nothing else going on, so I feel like we can really start... Hold on. Quick thought. Don't want to do that. Don't want to start building up inside. Or should I make defenses? I have been ignoring my defenses. It hasn't bitten me so far, but it could very easily do so. Um, let's do this. Let's take castle wall with him. No, let's not do that. Just a wooden wall should be fine. No, not wooden. Because then they'll just break through it. Uh, let's take a granite wall here with a granite door to get through if we need to. That will force them to go this direction. And then we'll just get some castle embrasure. Um, in a defensive position here. That's all we really need. Yeah, we are pushing our luck. And it's like, we got the builders. Why the hell not? Uh, Zeno, I actually wanted to check if you could get another undead. You're at 0 0.89, so likely not. But it's worth checking. So we'll see what happens when your arcane weakness wears off and see if you can keep this alive. Having four thralls would be incredible. In fact, I'm kind of surprised we haven't even gotten a Garonlin tree yet. Okay, it's gone, and you are still positive. Oh, you can have four. Okay, you are a crafting thrall. Oh my, oops. 
Uh, yeah, craft thrall. I don't even know what I'll have you do. So right now we'll just give you labor thrall. Actually, we'll give you brick thrall. But like, look at that. You're the best crafter in the colony now. Andrew Dan, you're embarrassing yourself. <laughs> it's actually kind of sad. <laughs> Oh, and before I forget, let's make two more pickaxes for them, because pickaxes are kind of where it's at. In fact, I'm probably going to have them start on uh, constructing soon to help with building up inside. We have Bricky Crafty Labor 1 and 2. Yes, we have Bricky Crafty Labor 1 and 2. <laughs> it is negative 20 outside, but it's a good temperature inside. Perfection. Let's stop using that. Uh, it's time to uh, take care of this, I think. And it's time a labor thrall wants to get out there. Thank you. And let's fill the marsh with as much poo as we possibly can here. Why not? Oh, it's on the... Oh, that sucks. Okay, advanced scraping is done. We're going to go to master scraping next. We're also going to move this out uh, a little bit because it actually got on some land there, and that'll stay until it rains and can make people sick. You know what? Why don't I just go and, like, shove it in the river? I've got the labor. Okay, that's done there. Uh, we're going to wait for this to get done. And then I'll start on everything else. Because that's really all we need right now. Uh, with the, the bridge here. And this here. I'm basically able to defend against quite a lot up until like mechanoids. Really. Because they'll have to travel in a straight line. I can hit that. Uh, I can hit that with a Fog of Torment. I can Valiant Charge it. I can hit it with a Cyanic Storm. Like, there's a lot that I could do against anything coming up the bridge. Uh, Steel Pickaxes are done, so let's get the two new Thralls to grab them. Let's destroy that. I want to get some of these Standing Lamps that I have up. No real reason, I just kind of want to. Next thing that we make absolutely has to be an aircon unit right there. Once we have the components. Drop pods are our worst enemy. Drop pods are always your worst enemy. I've had so many colonies die to drop pods. It's not even, it's not even amusing anymore. How are my, how, how's my stuff? Uh, really bad. Okay. I was going to see if I could like do some hunting here i was gonna see if i could get like a bunch of leather and make the skeletons leather armor i don't have to be raiding if i don't feel like it that's so weird in the meantime it is time to start walling We got plenty of bricks, lots of construction, an amazing miner. We can start working on this. Can I tame the birds? Birds? Oh yeah, that's actually a good idea. There's only three of them, and they're just meadow abs. They're not royals, but I will take it all the same. I 
I'm pretty pleased with things so far. It's the, it's the 13th of April, May. We're at negative 14 Celsius outside. We're still in a drought. Whatever that means. Because nothing changed. Should I start scarifying my skeletons too? Like, I mean, that would be Scrimshaw, basically. <laughs> There is nobody to convert. Also, kind of nothing to do right now. Huh. Uh, where's our butcher thralls? Both labor thralls are butcher thralls. That, yeah, like they'll take care of it. They'll take care of it. Winter drought. Never heard of it. Please brand my pets. <laughs> Master Scribing is done. We're going to go to Arcane Crafting next. And now that that's done, I'm going to go to here, and I'm going to get a Marble Scribing Table. I want that to get up pretty fast. I don't know if Andrew Dan can do it. Uh, no, he's going to Intellectual 1. I don't even think we have anybody that can do Magic Scribing right now. But we'll start, we'll start scrimshawing the pets. Uh, scrimshaw is a, uh, it's, it's a term that means carving into bone to make art. I, I don't know if I'm being obtuse there. Excuse me? Squish Xenomorph Tiki. I got gut worms. <sighs> well, at least Andrew Dan didn't get hit by it, but that's gonna really cost us on food. We got enough food right now that it's okay. And one thing I just realized I need to do also is I need to start replacing these walls with granite for insulation. I forgot about that and how important that is. The pets love it. <laughs> uh, apparently they still want it. Uh, yeah, we just did Brick Thrall. Brick Thrall wants another. Oh, it doesn't stick. You can't, you can't scarify them because they, they can't have scars. They heal them instantly because they're undead. Oh, well. Well, there's a lot of work to do. I'm glad Kara started on the bedrooms. And yeah, we're at a heal route. I'm seeing that right now. Completely out. Uh, we have very, very little in the way of cloth, but I want to try and make some blink scrolls if I can. Squish can't do it, and neither can Andrew Dan. Damn. It's a cheap way to get happiness. That's true, but I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it that way. I hate doing that. That, that feels exploitive. A raid! The Compact of Katadur. Uh, three people, they have a... Oh, they've got some really nice stuff. Marine armor. Low shield pack. U-pulse rifles. Fun. Tiny Fat Rabbit is coming back with that, uh, that deer. Alright, everybody. Time to introduce you to positions. Uh, all of yous. You draw fire. Uh, is that all our shooters? Oh my god, it is. Because uh, Tiggy doesn't get one. And it's negative 14 outside. Uh, let's watch and see. Okay, we got hypothermia shivering. And it is raising very quickly. 
It seems to slow down after 10, though. That could be that could be a good thing. It's getting near nighttime, so it's even getting colder. But that is going up, so we're going to have to watch if they go outside. The tabards are not enough. Hi. Where are you going? Where are you going? You know what? That That's very, very rude. Um, we, I don't want to summon a sentinel out there. No, we could. We totally could. Here, have a friend. It's now even stronger. Uh, yeah, they've got range on us. Let's, let's just go. Let's get them. In fact, I've, I've wanted to use this for so long. Medical emergency? Labor thrall, what happened? They destroyed your, you're an undead, you're fine. Labor Thrall goes, wait a minute, what heart? <laughs> I'm a zombie. Uh, wow. <laughs> that was every bit as satisfying as I wanted it to be. <laughs> oh. That was, that was really super satisfying. All right, good job, everybody. Oh, we did destroy their guns. No, we destroyed their guns. Okay, well, I know for the future. That was very much a learning experience on our new defenses and the temperature and all that, so I'm not upset. Like, I didn't use Valiant Charge at all. Uh, Andrew Dan? People are bleeding? Thanks. Thank you. Stop the bleeding. Thank you. Not in the bedroom. Not in the bedroom. Uh, let's strip these bodies. Because there's a low shield pack that I really want there. Um, and let's give this to Craft Thrall? Craft Thrall. Yeah, Craft Thrall. Get you some marine armor and flat goggles. And then go ahead and, uh, oh, Tiny Fat Rabbit's got that. That's fine. He's gonna wear it. <laughs> Get upset at the bodies. All right, Craft Thrall looks kind of badass, to be honest. <laughs> um, so there's one thing that I've been trying to look for for a long time. Sometimes your characters will start with scarves. I don't know where they are in, in, the, in this list here. I feel like I'm always missing them. Robe, burka, slave body strap, flop hat, shade cone, tail cap, 30 cap, slave collar, slice cap, visage cap, rod wrap, cape, jacket, duster. I don't see scarf. I see bandanas. Dog scarf. But I never see human scarf. It's very strange. It might be in, like, one of the apparels or something that I have to do. But I know it will greatly help when we have to wait, ar wait, ar wait around there during winter. Forced weather. A vengeful machine persona is threatening the Orion Corps soldiers of Orion installation. I would love goodwill from Orion. I, Yeah, I'll take goodwill from Orion. Uh, Force the weather around Tomb of the Holy Minigun to be a rainy thunderstorm for 10 days. Go for it. It's 10 days. And they gave me Hyperweave. 
Easy peasy. It's just gonna be a little loud for a while. A roof collapsed, what? Oh. Because nobody's... We're just mining the stuff out. We're not supplying the bricks because we're working on bricks over here right now. That's fine. That's totally fine. Uh, let's go ahead and make another one of these things. We have an icebreaker hand cannon, but I really think that we need some longer range. But that takes machining. And we are... I don't want to do machining just yet. I want to get magic uh, crafting first. I guess I could get longbows, but that's... I mean, guns are still going to be better than longbows. Winter has begun. And a colonist needs treatment. Right. Gut worms. Uh, the bedrooms need to stay warm. Other than that, everything is fine. And we do have enough food right now that it should last us through the winter. As long as nothing crazy happens. It's negative 30. Oh my god. It's so cold. Arcane crafting is done. Uh, and... It's elephant bow, elephant spear, and thrumbo there, which is what I really wanted. But I feel like I should stop. Go to maybe enchanting or... You know, we should probably go lower tech something. I probably should go machining. Surprised no one's super pissed off about being in the barracks. No, they don't seem to care. A flash storm. Oh no. The trees grew faster. <laughs> you know, I think I might go research until I can get stabs I think I already have that yeah I already have that okay so arcane crafting and that opened up stabs which are long range um I think ice and lightning are explosive fire creates fire let's make a lightning and an ice for our two shooters and then What does Armor of the Valiant take? 450 ingredients, 100 magicite, 20 silver, 5 gold. Now that's a no. Mage robes. Uh, I think they can be good, actually. Yeah, they're huddling together for warmth. That's, that's the point. Okay. We got Wanderer's Cloak, Mage Robes, Dreamcatcher Buckskin, Wizard Hat, Arcane Hood, Dreamcatcher Coronet. Uh, the mage robes are 100 ingredients, 400 unrefined magicite. Um, a little bit of armor, a little bit of insulation, a lot. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oh, my goodness. Okay, what about the wanderer's cloak? A little bit more expensive, a little bit more insulation, actually. Um, does not give better regen. So I'll make one Wanderer's Cloak, I think. And let's look at the Dreamcatcher Buckskin. 200 ingredients. Uh, max energy, class experience gain, and arcane resistance. I see. Much better armor, too. But that's... We want a mage robe for Zeno. And that should be it, really. That should be it. We've also got arcane hoods instead of the wizard hat, which is 80 ingredients, 60 unrefined magicite, a lot of energy regen, a lot. So, arcane hood. Um, Dreamcatcher Coronet is also experience gain, yeah. Also, a lot of medical stuff. Hmm. Huh. 
Think the hood is better for you? I think so too, yeah. But I was thinking like hood with wanderer's cloak, because they're supposed to be combined. But that one does not have the uh, resistance, it has, but the mage robe does. So we're going to see what happens there. Uh, that'll be craft thrall's job. Under required skill six. You need intellectual to make them two. Oh no. Can Squish do it? He's got zero in that in crafting, so he, he can do it. Will it be super slow? I'll, I'll let him make the first one. I'll see what happens. Because he's not slow at it. He's making the Wanderer's Cloak right now. Like, if it takes the skill off of his, uh, his research to determine the quality, that'll be amazing. Because his quality is 13 at that point, but his crafting is 0. All right, the Wanderer's Cloak is done. It is awful. Is it worth it? It is actually worth it, though. Um, yeah, max energy plus 12%. Ability cooldown negative 20%. Arcane resistance 5. Actually, that would not be good for... that. That's a Tiggy thing right there. So yeah, I, I guess a Squish can do it, but I'd rather get somebody else up there. So let's see what Andrew Dan's main jobs are tomorrow, and if they're... Oh, he can't do research. Oh, shit. Uh, Nobody is a magic crafter here. That sucks. <laughs> I need a magic crafter. Another air fleet sporulation. I think, yeah, we got a thousand hay. We're good. The calves bread. Oh, the, the muffalo's bread. That's cool. I didn't expect them to do that. All right, Squish, uh, making a mage rope. Okay. I'm thinking of stopping him from using plain leather, though. Let's make another Wanderer's Cloak, but no leathers. We have nothing else. Fine. We're also going to be going through a lot of Magicite to do this. Yeah, awful instead of nothing is basically what I'm saying right now. I was hoping I had more cloth or some muffalo wool, but it doesn't look like it. And let's do some more hunting, just for funsies. <gasps> Tiggy found compact machinery! Oh, and it's a lot of them. Yes! Yes, yes, yes! We got components! Finally! Oh my gosh! Is that fueled? That is. Um, I'm actually kind of wondering if I just want to leave it that way. We're actually not having a problem with wood like I expected. I'll at least get the electric tailoring bench for speed. But the smithy and the fueled stove do give us some power, so I'm cool leaving them as is. Or not power, heat. Go Tiggy, go.
The skeletons look ridiculous. I'm loving it. You know, maybe I should take the sentinels and uh, just detonate them all, move them out here. It's not a bad idea. They'll do that. The drought's over. It's like it's been raining for days. We'd never have noticed, though. Hey, labor thrall with a hat. Take care of the deer. We are out of potatoes. Officially out of potatoes. All right, Tiggy. Uh, once you're done with breakfast, you're going to go detonate these. Woo! That was a big explosion. That was fun. I liked that. Let's get some sentinels. Damn, Squish is taking a long time in this mage robe. It's only plain leather. I guess your techno bit isn't slowing you down right now, isn't helping you be faster now, is it? And... Two, one... There we go. A plain leather mage robe, normal quality. Oh. That's not bad. It's not bad at all. Uh, oh, and it goes under the parka. Now, how is your regen? Much better. Wow. Significantly better. And apparently can't make the arcane hood for some... We're probably out of uh, unrefined... Oh. Now, are we out of unrefined magicite or leathers? We have plain leather. I don't know. Kara finished this, though. Like, we got the components. There we go. Cannot make it, need material. We're out of unrefined magicite. With five. That makes sense, actually. Uh, we will get it eventually, though. So, you know, not a big deal. Uh, Labor Thrall, if you could please deliver to this torch lamp, somebody will take care of it tomorrow. I don't like the, the brown, but it's okay. Uh, lathe is finished. Which means we can work on machini next, and I just realized something? The cape goes over the clothing. The mage robe goes under it. You can wear both at the same time. The mage robe and the cloak. We just need a lot of plain leather. Whoa, meteorite shower. Holy crap, that scared the hell out of me. But we got gold, steel, ore, slate out of it. That was a big boom. I look the part with the colors crappy. Yeah, I know. I know. That's why I'm kind of like looking around here going like, what can I kill? Get better leather. But there's nothing really. Basically, until the, until we like shave the mumpalos, there's nothing. And then we're going to have to get a bunch of magicite. Uh, labor thralls, I want you to have at least a four in construction. So that when I need you to do small jobs, you can. Like that. Oh, and it's negative 28 in here. I should have thought of that. Uh, let's... Dun, 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 wooden wall. And a door. 
and then a campfire inside. They'll work faster. Kara, do this. Use our wood, because apparently we have a, a lot of it. Could I go blue with the Aerofleet leather from Wild Ones? I don't know. Probably. I honestly don't know. I mean, I could probably grow Tinctoria and, like, dye the clothing. There we go. That'll warm up, warm it up in here a little bit, which will help prevent hypothermia and uh, make it so we work a little bit faster. The rain will help since they go boom if you kill them. I mean, that's true. But they're gone. <laughs> they're all gone. All we have are the ones that joined us, and I kind of want to keep them for the, the blue gel. I think we're just going to get light leather or plain leather from these. Yeah. Ooh, a Garonlin tree! It's right next to us, too. We'll get Zeno to take care of that tomorrow. Oh, no, Brick Thrall can do that, can't they? Nope, not Plant Cutter. Okay. Um... Yeah, I'll, I'll have Zeno do it tomorrow. I gotta remember to start putting Sentinels up again, too. That doesn't need to be powered. It's most definitely cold enough. None of the thralls are set to plank it. No, they're not. No, I'm gonna have Zeno take care of it tomorrow. Oh no, Zeno's up actually. Why are you up? Uh, where do we want to plant this thing? Now we'll throw it down here. No. Yeah. I don't know if I like that spot though. God damn it again! Lightning. Rude. And then we want to give it to one of the thralls. Now, uh, I've decided whatever thrall I give this to, first off, they have to be good at plant cutting, so it's probably going to be craft thrall. No, not craft thrall. One of the labors. We'll do one of the labors. Uh, yeah, we'll do this labor here. Um... But basically, they become nothing but a tree thrall. Because it takes up so much of their time, and if they die, we lose that tree. Can I bond with the tree this time? No. No, it takes up so much time to do it. It takes so much time to prune these damn trees. And she's dried cased. I'm. We could go medicine maker, actually. Yeah, we'll go medicine maker. And set it to about 75. And that's basically all they do now. Because this, this is at double speed of what it normally is. <laughs> because I have a mod to speed up the Garonlin tree pruning. Because it takes so freaking long. Basically, when you get a Garonlin tree, that's all you do. <laughs> you don't do anything else anymore. <laughs> Spawning immature dried in 7.6 days. 
Honestly, the Garanlan trees, very underwhelming. Still kind of disappointed with them, still trying to find a way to, to make them useful, you know? Still haven't found it. Alright, get out of that. Start filling this up. And like so. This is five. Five. I just wanted to make sure on that size in there. You know what? I don't want them gathering up here. Uh, I like the campfire, but at the same time, we've got a gold statue there that I want to keep using for looks. People impressed with our rec room, dining room, craft room, throne room. And that's maxed out psionic storm. Still friggin' cool. I wonder if they can shoot her in the air when she's flying around. Like, I didn't pay attention when she was doing it, but I really wonder if they could do that. Like, if I sh need to shield her first, you know? One more level for Master... Nah, for... Nah, master... Nah, 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 master Craftsman. Nah, nah, nah. Anybody else can do social yet? No, nobody else can do social. There's the arcane hood finished, and Tiny Fat Rabbit's trying to put it on immediately. Bad Tiny Fat Rabbit. Uh, that is the yeah, energy regen. That goes to Zeno. Stop it. Get your damn cowboy hat back on. Weird fat rabbit. Uh, that's kind of in a good shape. Okay, Zeno, your magic regen is now enough to get another thrall. We've got no bodies, though. Eh, we did kind of use them up. I'm looking at my characters going back, uh, going, I'm becoming like a dark nature necromancer. I suppose. Tiny Fat Rabbit really wants to be a wizard. Put on the wolfskin wizard hat. So wants to be a wizard. Sorry, buddy. You're not a wizard. You have no magical ability. Machining is done. Uh, gunsmithing is next. Want to get them bolt action rifles. And I've got the components for them. So let's get this started. We struck even more compacted machinery. Randy blesses me. And the hallway's now connected. God, Tiggy is so fast. So fast. We can get rid of that, that. Uh, no, keep him, keep him, keep him, keep him. We need to get Florin in there first. My minions are literally bonding to nature, and I'm tilling the land with my minions to provide us food. That's true. That's true. All right, so this is going to be the hospital, so that'll be sterile flooring, but we don't have sterile flooring yet. So let's go with marble slabs. Eh, nah, just wood. Wood's fine. Um, prison. I'm just going to smooth the flooring there, because it doesn't really matter. Um, checkered slabs. And then I need something in the middle to let them know that they're dot, that they're, they're in trouble. I do like the mosaic tile. It is very pretty. It's like shower tile, though. <laughs> is there uh, plant-like armor? 
Yeah, kinda. Let's go with Parquet Harry Butt in the middle. I mean, that would be the closest you get to that is the Dreamcatcher Buckskin. Which, uh, I don't know if we can... Yeah, you can't even see it behind the text right now. But yeah, that's about the closest you get. It's just patchwork buckskin of leather. That's about the closest you get to a druidy armor. Searching carpeting yet? No, there'll be no reason to. <laughs> we can't do anything with it. We don't have claw. Uh, and getting the power up to get hydroponics going is expensive. You have some kind of dye or color changing mod. I mean, yeah, we've got. I, I can do that. Um, I can also just have you do like this. But you can't dye clothing unless we have a tinctoria. So there's a way to do that vanilla game, but we don't have the tinctoria to do it. So you know, why'd you just spawn it? Oh, with the gut worms. Yeah. So yeah, I've got a mod for it, but your character will change the color of it right away. Unless you use the dye thing. <gasps> Shearing Lindsay! Oh my god. Please dismount the goddamn buffalo. There. Did we just get only 20 wool out of that? No, we got 140. Okay, good. I want to ASAP make tabards. Three of them. Clear all. Only muffalo wool. And I want craft thrall to be the one to do it. Uh, shred mechanoids if we ever run into mechanoids. Other than that, everything else is good. We're fine. Could you? Could somebody get that out of there? Everybody's forced to go around this one rock now. <laughs> oh, never mind. That that mosaic towel looks really terrible. Uh, next to the next to the checkered slabs. Uh, Harry and bone checkered slabs. Is it marble flagstone? Yeah, it is. Okay. That looks disgusting. All right. Uh, we got the park at Harry and bone. Let's go with mosaic wood floor instead. Look for a dark green, almost black color to mix with the dark nature thing. Sure. I'll give that an eventual yes, maybe. I should give the icebreaker to somebody. Give it to the fat rat. Tiny fat rabbit. God, with the checkered slabs, that room, it just looks like a bathroom. I never planned to build for a bathroom in here. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, I'll figure out a bathroom somewhere. Like, I love Dub's Bad Hygiene, and then I guaranteed forget about it constantly. All right, craft thrall. I don't know why I'm hesitating. Cannot make tabard need material. Okay, gunsmithing's done. Uh, we could go for the semi-auto rifle. We could go for wait until gas operation to get the heavy SMG, which I think is a great idea. 
heavy SMGs are super duper powerful. Why can't we make taverns? We apparently made two of them already. Oh, people are freaking wearing them. Take that off. You're rude. You're rude. People are freezing. Take it. Do you have one? No. Okay, there was only two. There was only two. Uh, so Squishy and Kara. Grab those. One of those mods you use so often you just tend to forget it's there. I've gotten so used to it that I honestly don't know how to play without Dubs Bad Hygiene anymore. I honestly have no idea how to play without it now. <gasps> it's a space battle! Space battle! Alright, we're setting in the thralls. Uh, we're capturing everything. Everything. Brick thrall, refuel that. Craft thrall, go get that capture there. Okay, F tree thrall, go get Oxana. Probably won't reach her in time. I mean, she fell from orbit. Probably should have sent Tree Thrall out there. It's kind of dangerous. That almost hit him. Oh my god. Oh. I don't want to lose Tree Thrall. He's very important to me. Oh no, let's send him out a pathway across the freaking country. And there's a Baxter. Purity Catnip. What a name. Everybody, a tiny fat rabbit's trying to distract us by throwing a binge party right now. Alright, I need to make sure that Andrew Dan is taking care of people. When they get here. If they get here. Ooh, what just happened? Oh, no! No brick thrall! Purity catnip, no! You know, we never got any of those, uh... Those birds, did we? So let's try and get some horses. Ooh, hello, Waltz. Capture. And another one. Ho! Space battle's over! We did it! We got lots of captures! Where are you going, Labor Thrall? Oh, there's a dead horse over there. <laughs> Alright, Andrew Dan, I need you. No, do not attend this party. Why is Tiggy doing both of these? Uh, you know what, Tiki? I'm taking you off doctoring. Andrew Dan can take care of this. Well, let's let's do a little triage here, see which ones we want to keep. That's a Woodsman, Body Purist, Boundless. Shooting Woodsman. That's incredible. I don't like Body Purist, but I can deal. Pessimist, Psionic. We don't need another Psionic, so Purity Catnip is one that we definitely want to try and save. Uh, she's no longer bleeding out, though. Uh, ba oh, Baxter already got healed up. Never mind. Let's get these two. And then after, I want all 16 of these corpses hauled into one spot, please. Oh, I love space battles. What am I doing? Uh, okay, how is a medical emergency? Uh, three hours. Misogynist, bloodless, intellectual, social, medical. We need to save him. He's incredible. Save him, save him, save him. You're saved now! And Waltz. Uh, death in two. Slow learner, pyromaniac kind. I care less about you, but we'll tend to you anyway and maybe sell you. You are saved now! What is that? Uh, okay, um...
No, just give me YouTube. Congratulations. You are being rescued. Please do not resist. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. <laughs> He just hits the killy like clothes lines her and goes, Congratulations, you are being rescued. Please do not resist. <laughs> uh okay, this guy's incredible. I want him to be probably the colony leader, to be honest. Uh Waltz is crap. Uh Purity Catnip needs to be on our side. Baxter is psionic and pessimist. But he's kind. He's also a cook. Uh, should I? I don't honestly. Know. I think I'll put him in a. We don't have a gladiator arena. Go with a flan. Flan is pyromaniac. Um. So I think we have a goal now. I need to get four more points here. And I need to get gladiatorial combat. The eyeball steel club. I hate those. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? Oh, no. Clarkson got hit by lightning and exploded. Wow, Randy. Wow. I think it requires Raider. I'm not sure. Raider or Supreme. I think you're right. Trying to look around here for anything else that we could grab. Uh, Zeno has inspired taming. Um, in fact, I think I might be able to go tame this warg. Let's go get a warg, Zeno. I love this. Just just a normal guy. Head's kind of spiky. Turns to the side. Whoa! <laughs> hey, buddy, you're mine now. Congratulations! Please do not resist. Boop. And, uh, if you'd like, there's meat on the menu. There's so many of these bodies. I feel like I should be butchering them. I want to get these weapons, because I can still use those. Solar flare. Oh, I hate solar flares. It's negative 19, Randy. They can sleep in the cold for one night. They'll be fine. Oh, the prison's almost done. Why does my prison always get done first? Mm. Work should be called Scrappy Doo. You got it. Scrappy Doo. The worst. The worst. <sighs> so, what do I do with these people that I captured and I don't want to keep? Also, who's starving? Squishes. Ah, uh, it's the gut worms, yeah. I said that uh, the food would last us over winter. Unless something happened. Gut worms? That's a thing that happened. Uh, Purity Catnip, go get yourself a bed. There's an actual bed in here. I'm trying to make you happy. There we go. Solar flare's ending. Temperatures can go back up from freezing. 
Uh, let's increase power here. There we go. Scooby-Doo asshole nephew that is now a full-grown killer. I mean, did anybody not see that coming? Y'all watch the show. Scrappy-Doo is a maniac. There is absolutely no doubt in my mind that Scrappy-Doo would 100% become a serial killer. Um, let's see. This room can just be slabs for now. Uh, same with the freezer. And let's go with... I love the look of herringbone, to be honest. I, oh, I've always loved the look of herringbone. Release or ransom? I cannot ransom them. Um, I don't have mach I don't have a uh, um, microelectronics yet. I might want to work on that next, to be honest. But I want to get guns first, blowback operation, and then gas operation after that, so I can get the SMGs. The live action movie proves he was releasing demons out in human bodies for power. Okay, I've never seen the live-action movies. And now I feel like I'm missing out. Why are all these horses dead? I wanted to tame the horses, now they're all dead. What is going on? <laughs> Oh, thank goodness the weather controller's no longer changing the weather. That was driving me a little bit insane. Are we out of wood again? Yeah, we are. Actually had some grow here, so... Uh, let's go after it. Oh my god, it's quiet again. Lightning killed them? I thought it was uh, they got hit by one of the... the mortars coming down from the space battle. Um, and just to show my absolute uncaringness for human life, uh, we're just going to dump all this fecal matter onto them. How do they still have weaponry? Nobody check their pockets? Could have been lightning. Randy was holding back. No punches there. He wanted to hit everybody with lightning. He killed Clarkson the Arrow Fleet with lightning while on a wooden bridge while standing next to Kara. Like, can I raise another? Oh, yeah. You absolutely can. Undead army. Let's make sure nobody else is caught in that. Okay, you're negative one four four right now. We'll see what that can, what, how that affects things. Um, more haste and undead, so they move faster. Undead movement and extra speed increased by five percent per skill level. Why did you go up there? What, what were you grabbing? And zero three five. You're still in perfect shape. Oh my god, that's five now. Five. Uh, Ron here. It, it's a dig thrall. Hells yeah. So let's take one of the labor thralls. Copy that over. And instead just give him mining. Hells to the yeah. Actually, can I have him construct? I can. Uh, Mad Raccoon, oh no. Oh no, oh dear god. Oh, that's actually it. 
There's, that's Tiggy, that's not a Thrall. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. Uh... Well, that's morbid. He's got a taste for human flesh! Okay. Uh, another... You learned of an ancient complex. Oh! It is the 11th of winter. I might go after that once the season changes. That's not a bad idea. Conversion ritual, I want to go after Purity Catnip. Let's begin. Let me tell you about Kefka. The monster. The man. Our god. Done. Down to 13%, and then hit her with a conversion. And she's now on our side. <laughs> Just like that. God, Squish is good. Oh, wow, Squish is good at that. Squish, Squish, you, for you forgot to take her back to bed. She's not on her side yet. She just worships the same god. Crafty Diggy Tree, Bricky, and Labor Boy. <laughs> Labor Boy. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I like that. <laughs> I like that. Okay, uh, get you guys into real beds. Probably make you happier. I mean, not like I care. Baka. A raid! Subjects from the Thou uh, Thowim Dynasty! Uh, I can't tell what they are because they're all in burkas. Uh, they've got nothing. Okay. Uh, prepare for wild and attack, and they have a bladesman with a bow. You silly buggers. Looks like they're a medieval colony. I'm not sure. Yeah, dynasty, they're, they're medieval. Okay. Everybody, let's go and hang out. Please get off the muffalos. They don't need to be here. Get off the warg! My god. Did I ever make those stabs? No, I never did. Okay. Jade. Oh, I see. I have jade, don't I? No, I don't. Huh. Okay, I'll have to go trade for some. I can't trade for anything. Damn. Uh, Dig Thrall needs a weapon. Um, you know what? I'm gonna give the hatchet here. Tree Thrall, which will help with the planting. And Dig Thrall can get... their pickaxe. And there goes the sentinel. I'm going to let it get right in there, and then shatter it. Oh, I didn't actually do that much. I thought it would be an explosion. Where is my earth-shattering kaboom? Get her, skeleton army! I don't know what armor these guys have. Uh, none. Okay. Well, that makes my job very easy. Ooh. Whoa, what was that? Did one of them just explode? And cut off Andrew Dan's left second toe? What the hell just happened? Was that the bladesman that died? No? Who just exploded? Oh, I mean, they they, they died. I guess, I guess we're okay. Uh, Xeno, capture Ricket here. Oh, wait, there's still somebody shooting. Oh, hi. Uh, Thralls. Get her. Them. Can't tell. Uh, Labor Thrall, you're undead, buddy. Uh, you, you literally don't have a heart. I cannot wait till they fix that. This has got to be intimidating or something, right? Get your damn pickaxe back. 
Oh no, we lost Diggy. Still not running. What? Why are you a medical emergency? You don't have a liver to destroy. God, I cannot wait till they fix that. Avenge Diggy before we just, you know, bring him back to life. Well, or something. All right, Zeno, get our boy back. Didn't even go skeleton yet. That's just rude. And of course, they take the muffalos back inside. Because why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you ride a muffalo when it's right there? Need more rituals to do. Uh, let's build one of these. I haven't done that for a while. OMG. You really want to do this right now? Uh, brick thralls right in the middle of it. <laughs> Squish, def defend yourself, buddy. Purity Catnip, you better not die. I'll be very upset with you if you die from this. They got Bricky and took his pick. You monsters. I'll go save Purity Catnip. I wanna, I wanna get her back down. <laughs> Uh, Andrew, Andrew Dan. Capture. There we go. Oh, bad. You're. He's still alive. Okay, we can still we can still do something with this guy. What? A jerk. Tiggy, you don't sleep through this. Oh, they they did die. I mean, neither of those are ones I wanted to keep, so I'm kind of okay with it. I don't know if I'm more upset about the bed or Bricky. Get your ass up. <laughs> Bricky boy. Bricky boy. Boop. And you do bricks. Alright, uh, Purity Catnip. We need Purity Catnip to stay fine. Flan is lost a leg. Uh, let, let's, let's tend Flan really quick, because leg. And then Waltz, left arm, right kidney. Oh my god. Zeno, do you want to have some chill? Any? Our body pile is a little full right now. Oh yeah, I guess Squish is bleeding too. <laughs> so Squishy, sup? Oh, you know, bleeding. How are you? <laughs> what kind of question is that? <laughs> what 
Wait, was he hitting on him? Is that what I was hearing there? Oh, goodness me. I could go nutrient paste dispensers here, but I honestly think that we're better off cooking. We're not really missing out on anything. I mean, we might be during the growing season, but right now everything is fine. Uh, do I have enough mana for one more minion? No. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. That's a, that's a big negatory. You are 0 0.36 every five seconds. No. <laughs> like, maybe, maybe if we get you one of the staves and a lot of clarity, but right now it's not happening. Uh, oh, we can begin the Fiesta of Kethka. Yeah. W Ooh, I can reform! Remove a meme, change structure, change style, add a meme. Unlimited changes to precepts, deities, narrative text, other symbols. This is what I've been waiting for. Uh, shit, what do we want to get? <laughs> we wanted to get a gladiatorial thing, but I think that means I should add a meme. Do we add raider or superior? Uh, requires one of the precepts, rating respected, rating required, execution horrible if innocent, don't care, so you've got to disable four precepts, shooting specialist, melee specialist, symbol burning, supremacist, ex slavery is acceptable and honorable, execution required and respected if dealt guilty, execution don't care, shooting specialist, melee specialist, specialist symbol burning. Um... I mean, guilty doesn't really work with supremacist is the problem. We could also add in transcendence for magical and start giving people magic. Can we add animalist? No. Why? You mean like animal personhood or rancher? Why? Hmm, I'm thinking of adding in Raider. It means Raiding is required, which I'm totally okay with. Basically, it does the same thing as Supremacists. We got so many animals. No, we don't. We have four. Five, maybe. I think. I don't know. I haven't really been paying attention to this, the, the Aero Fleets. Uh, I'm going to go with Raider. Uh, the following precepts are incompatible with this new meme selection that will be removed. Pain and Skull Spike. Really? I mean, I'll try it. Did we lose Abstract Theist? Uh, charity is essential. Rating is also required. These are kind of... Huh. Can I go back on that? Because I think we have to be supremacists. I don't... Guilty and supremacist. I cannot be guilty. And be anything else. I could get the, rid of the guilty meme. And go supremacist instead. Like I could just delete guilty. Um, and say that I'm over it. <laughs> yeah, I think we'll go with Raider and maybe delete Guilty later. All right, uh, execution, horrible if innocent. That makes sense. Uh, now we could add roles shooting and melee specialist. Which, they always get the dumbest names for these. So it's always got to be Berserker. Um, S 
Snipe Mine. It's such a dumb name. It's such a dumb name. <laughs> but we do get the Gladiator Duel, which is definitely what I wanted. Now, for the Gladiator Duel, I want to do where when we do it, we have a chance to get a random recruit. We do need to name it, though. Fight of Life! Yes! Now, we're going to call it uh, Fight of the Worthy. We're trying to make ourselves worthy again, but we're doing it through sinister means. We reform, we've earned our forgiveness. I mean, more like we've forgiven ourselves through our own superiority, and we're gonna do that through the power of raiding. Like, we're guilty, but, you know, we realize in this harsh world, we've got to, we, it, it, it's, it's kill or be killed, eat or be eat, dominate the others. And so we start raiding the others, and then eventually we kind of get over our guilt um, and uh, and become supremacists instead. What if I change to the ranged role? Um, you would get uh, shooting accuracy plus seven percent, aiming time negative fifty percent. That would be practically unstoppable with a, with the minigun. Plus, the bad thing about that though is it disables a lot of work, including growing plant cutting. Like, so much. I lose farmer my minion to take care of that. Yeah, basically. Okay, I think... Yeah, I think we're good. From an unforgettable feast of a fiesta of Kafka, plus eight mood for six days. And what new rituals do we get now? Where is the gladiator arena? Do I have to build it? So yeah, fight of the worthy. Um, it's only there, which is fine. Which is fine. But basically, same thing. They have to beat one of the skeletons to join the colony. If I don't just choose that they can join the colony. Because, like, purity catnip? Hell yeah. Also, woodsman, boundless, shooting? That's probably going to be our sniper, to be honest. I think that's Evie. Uh, Waltz lost an arm and a kidney. They're going to have to fight. Flan lost a leg. Uh, they're going to have to fight. Rickett. He's definitely going to have to fight. Purity Cadet is fine. Like, that's Eevee. May I please change the sniper roll? Okay, seriously, man. There's no point in you changing to the sniper roll. Well, actually, no, there is. We just got to decide what jobs you would be doing after that, which is the hard part, because you would lose growing, you'd lose plant cutting. Um, okay, let's just look here. Like, it might be better to just wait for Purity Catnip to join. Can't cook, which you are the main cook right now. Can't construct, grow, mine, plant, cut, smith, tailor, craft, quarry, butcher, brew, repair, deconstruct, harvest, draw, drugs, fabrication, mining. You can only research and hunt. That's it. That would be a terrible role for you. <laughs> And remember, you can make all the, all the all the requests you want, but I have the final say in what goes on. It might be time to move in here. That's going to bug me. Damn it, I'm going to have to waste resources now. I don't want to. Vending machine? <gasps> That's how that works! Oh my god, I've never actually looked at that before. That's for something else. A uh, hospitality thing. I feel like I should start working on the rest of rooms. Um, let's see here. One, two, three away here. One, two, three there. So if we go like... 15 to 11. 
That could be a good dining room slash throne room slash rec room. And then I want a hallway here and here, which means the center part, one, two, three, right here. Um, that's actually not bad, except for the fact that it's 10 across, and I hate that. Oh, I just, I messed that up. Hold on. One, two, three away. There we go. Okay. Uh, in that case, one, two, three here. One, two, three there. That is eight across. That might actually be a better chapel, to be honest. Unless I just didn't want this hallway here. I got a hallway here. Do I really need it? Yeah. Yeah, I do. No, I no, I mm. It's a tough decision. How much room do I get there? 14 by 11, which is pretty darn large. I could split that down the center and get two of these instead. Um, or something like that. Well, I could have a chapel like this and then a one room thing like that. Ooh, no, 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 no. I could do like this and have a bathroom right there. Chapel here. That That's not bad. Chapel might be a little small. Um, shit, that is small, isn't it? Do I want to have it the big-ass size? What if I did, like, dent, dent, and then just, just bathroom stalls instead of a big one? That's a bit better. 8 by 11. Yeah, I think that's good. I think that's good. i got to figure out how to get power into here. I'm thinking it might be time to start, after this is done, on the water mill generators and have water mill generators just all the way up and down this. And then block it off here with some heavy bridge. But, um, I think that we did pretty good today, Augment Mind. Augments are always on, I believe. Automatically, must be trained in at least once to become active. The scope requires two ability points to level. Okay, and movement. I think I'm going movement. Yeah, movement there. Let's look at everybody, see what their skills are, what they can try up here, if there's anything new. I could get something new for Andrew Dan. I could get... I think I actually think I want to be starting to work on, on heal. Like, we used Valiant Charge once, but heal is used all the time. Uh, Tiggy is almost maxed out on Sentinels, which is good. Fat Rat has nothing. Anyway, um, I got to the goal that I wanted to do, which was the very first change in the Magitech Empire. And we will be doing more very, very soon. <clears throat> We'll see where this goes, and we'll see where everything else goes. I've got some magic items. Things are in remarkably good shape. And I am honestly pretty happy. In fact, very soon, we're gonna get a single dryad? Single, just one. I've waited all this time for one dryad. I know, Randy, I'm angry too. One Medicine Maker Dryad in four days. That's a little bit more than, than a bit ridiculous. That's just, that's ridiculous. Uh, oh, hello. 
Mitro, uh, Mitro, and the encampment. Zosa, Zogzo. Not even trying. Mitro, Arkic, chief of the Lagua Alliance, sent us a message. Apparently, subjects based nearby camp have written their caravans. The camp is controlled by Fenevita. It is the 14th of August. I may do this. Seven subjects. I will not do this. Kara could take that alone. Shit. That doesn't matter. But we're going to continue this tomorrow, likely. Uh, I, I need to see what days Tiki has off this week so I can start working on the 70s die server. Other than that, uh, if you like what you saw, make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube. Follow on Twitch, follow on Twitter, join us on Discord, ask for a colonist. Uh, like uh, Kara, and uh, you've seen Pomanja a couple times before Tiny Fat Rat joined. Uh, which is about the same time that I was looking for a name anyway. You know, it's first come, first serve. Um, they are both from YouTube. They both requested to be in the colony. And now they are. You can see yourself here. And make tiny requests, much like uh, Xenomorph has. Well, not like... Okay. Tiny requests, much like Squish has. Xenomorph requests the sky. Um, <laughs> anyway. I'm Omni Rusted. You're smart and funny and deserving of all good things i'll see you next time it's okay zeno it's all right i'm, I'm teasing it's, i'm teasing <laughs> <laughs>